the Dr. Green Jump Show. Not a nice That one right. Yeah. Hey, it's the Dr. Green Thumb show right here on um, B Real TV, YouTube, Twitch, and Discord. What's poppin', B? What's good? Um, Back by popular demand, Mr. Goodlight C minus. What up, everyone? Yep. Happy Friday. Nice, uh, nice jacket you got on oh, there, buddy. Oh, thanks, man. What do you mean? What do you mean it's a nice jacket? <laughs> Uh, uh, we got Psycho Lizzy on a Friday. That's Woo. good. That's right. Hey, how did that happen? It, it just happens. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. It's a strong Friday. It's a little to our bro, Steph Tone. Whoa. What are you smoking crack with that thing over there, buddy? <laughs> fuck was that? What the fuck was that? Huh. It's the Cairo set you up with the torch. No. Um, and the Snipe Tower, Bolton, Blombo, and Bra Bra, and the Dominator. Oh, you know, we're just bicking back, being bull, I'll, hanging out. I'll be that. You know just, what I'm saying? Just I'll patrolling, running shit up here. Fast finger Dom. That's very various. We're making sure uh, Bobo gets here. Uh, <laughs> yeah, he said around round about two thirty. Round round about two thirty, son. So we just got snacks chilling, billing. Damn, super focused. Damn, look at him. It's pissed off. Snacks is in the building. Um, <laughs> did we curse? Did I? Curse? The thing we both did. Did we curse? I don't remember. I don't, I don't remember. So. No, no. Did I? How about it, uh, Bolton no. or Ra Ra or Dominator? I didn't hear anything. He said you dropped f bombs, but he said we both drop f bombs. Everyone, I don't know. Let's, let's do rewind it. the tape. Uh, I don't remember this. <laughs> Playback. I think they're just trying to get it. How many? One or two? <laughs> One each. I think they said we both did it, but when? I don't, I don't remember <laughs> doing that. Yeah. I don't think so, Yeah, buddy. they're saying I don't think so. Yeah, you guys are setting this up. Yeah, don't yeah. be trying to yeah. set me up, Mike. <laughs> okay. And for no reason. <laughs> the one who says he loves. Kyra loves you. Don't steal his wave. Kyro. Stefan. Don't hey. steal the wave. Shout out to Dom. Yeah. Killing it on the base earlier. He's yeah. Oh man. Yeah. Dom Dom kills that upright base. Boy. Dom is the man. Real talk, baby. Yeah, we need Dom in the mix show. And the concentrate king in the house. What's up, everybody? The guy who got his jar fingered by Mr. Uh, Mike Tyson. We talked about that yesterday. I, I'm sure you did. <laughs> how, how, how the champ finger banged your jar. It, he really did. And, and there's nobody in the world that would get away with that. You know, and real talk. I was like, I was devastated, but also honored at the same time. I'm like, you know what? It's all right. Mike finger fucked my jar. He's the oh, there you go. Dude, yeah, there problem? you go. That sounds like a... I earned that, that one. That's that one why, I know that, about. That's why I said finger bang. <laughs> the jar. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I, I know you thought he was going to put it in his mouth. Oh, for sure. We all did. <laughs> like, we all did. He wasn't playing. Man. That one was clear. Yeah. Wow. That's, that that's, that was was no baiting. I really <laughs> I really think Mike Tyson and Cali Blaze would be great friends. Why? Because we like eat mushrooms. Yeah, yeah, and you guys were like oh. known as this violent, angry I, person. I, I think <laughs> I think Mike was on shrooms when he got to us. Oh, don't think he <laughs> said heard. it. Yeah, he I think he, he had taken an eighth before he <laughs> yes, he, he came to us. And, and then you go rate. give him another gram and a half. No, he ate almost three grams. It was a four gram bar. He ate like three quarters. You guys are in the hero club, oh, right? Oh my yeah. god, he wasn't playing. Oh, Mike, and, Mike is strong. Yes, and I need to make a quick correction because I did hear you guys talking about his scoop. So that jar was about 420 grams. That scoop on his finger was about eight to 10 grams. Oh Cause if God. you look at the jar that I put it in that, they call it a bowler jar, that fits an ounce. There was almost a half. Yeah, you ounce. gave him a nice. Oh, bro, trust look, at me. That. look at that, look at that finger it swipe. A, it was at least, and by the way, the, the, the rosins are a lot, a lot lighter. That's just like a filter or the, hey, that's not what it looks like. Hey. It's like white. The, you know, that's the champion jar because, right. you know, it's got Mike Tyson's DNA in it there. It sure man. does, man. That's it's like I, they're playing Fruit Ninja. And you yeah. just wiped on the iPad. He's but like, that was like a quarter-round scoop, not a two, three-gram. That was like a quarter-round scoop. But 
Hey, he deserved it. Does he die? Oh, yeah. Hey, die? everybody was like, <gasps> Oh, we all did. We gasped. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, look at that. Look at that. Shit. He was on one, man. He was in such a great mood, though. Because it looks delicious, it's though. Good. He smelled it. He goes, Oh, my God. It's, it's like you can eat it. And then literally just. I thought he was going to eat it. Finger. So did we. Because he's, he's known for <laughs> grabbing things and just stuffing his mouth. I hurt. thought he was going to eat it yep, too. We all did. And I got to tell you, I think he would have definitely felt it because the THC got to go through the liver, my. It does, but it's got to decarboxylate first. So if nah, you just. Eat, if it's got THC content it is, in it. But it's very low. So just so you guys know a little mm, chemistry. Yeah. With the reason we decarb it is so everything will have a certain amount of THC, but when it's in that form, there's a lot more THC. CA than THC. So decarboxylation is a fancy word for removing the carbon molecule at the end of it. So it's like that carbon molecule is what prevents it. Uh, you need it to be what's called an 11 hydroxy, which allows your liver to process it. Mm. With the carbon molecule on the end, it'll pass through your liver without being grabbed. When you knock off that carbon, decarb, the carb is carbon. So you're decarbing, you're taking the carbon off the end of the chain. And that's what allows it to be an 11 hydroxy, which will get you high. So if you eat it, you'll get a buzz. Yeah. You decarb it, it'll you get, blow your yeah. nipples off. I feel yeah. like if you eat a Mike Tyson scoop, though, you're going to. You'll feel it. something from that. If you oh, ate yeah. that big scoop, yes. you were going to feel something. For sure. I mean, even if you were just like laid back, relaxed. For sure. You, you would feel something because there's enough <laughs> yeah. in there. Hell yeah. It wasn't like it was a little baby gram dab. I mean, he took like <laughs> a quarter round. A quarter rounds, yeah. Lit. Look at that. Yeah. Oh, he, he, was on, he was on the verge. Yeah, he would have been lit. <laughs> <laughs> Molecules. Like, <laughs> he's, he's a monster, bro. Hey, like I was saying, though, the other day, our bro is in great shape oh, right man, now. Oh, man, he looked great. He looked like he was ripped. Cut up. You don't want to fight with, no. with Mike right now. He will knock that ass out. You don't want to fight him when he's heavy? No. You don't want to fight him now. Like, his his Well, even more so right. now because hey. you think, like, he's now he's lighter again. So his reaction time and, speed. you know, like, stamina and speed and strength are like, mm, nah, you don't want that. <laughs> hey, man, yeah. You don't want that smoke, no. baby. I don't ever, the what? only smoke you want from Mike Tyson is if he passes you his Word. joint. Look yeah. at his biceps, man. He ain't playing games. <laughs> Look at this. You should have seen the, his forearms were like, yep. like, his, like on some Popeye-ish. You know <laughs> yeah. what I'm saying? And he's, what, 55 or something, something like that? 55, 56? Good catch. I think, I uh, think Mike that. is 53, 54. Oh, really? Yeah, oh, I, I thought think he was he's a that. little early. No. Okay. But he, he is still 55, looked... according yeah. to Google. Oh, there you go. There you go. Okay. Right rules. Tight. Yeah. No, he, man, he's, in, he's in great shape. 55, man, he looks great. Yeah, for 55? He looks great. He does. 55! And if you see his training videos... He's still putting, he ain't playing, man. Yeah, ever. He looks great. He no, looks that's, great. In my lifetime, that's probably the greatest. He is the greatest same. heavyweight champion same. of all time. Same. Yeah. No I doubt. Think, right. I think all around right. cool, cool person, though, because now Mike's able to be himself at all, like an extreme level, where I guess in the 90s, you know what I mean? He was, uh, you know, scrutinized for every action. Everything. Yeah. Well, yeah. when you hold the title, yep. and when you hold not, not just the title, all of them, like when you do that thing that 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 heavyweights, like that's one of their things. They don't just want to be the champ; they want to unify the title and be the champ. Yeah. Right. And when you do that, the the scrutiny on you is like a thousand times it would be that it, that if you just held the 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 belt in this weight class. I mean, you know, you're still popular, and they you know they still do all the coverage on you, but it's not like being the guy of guys. Yeah, heavyweight champ is like, and he had that. No. Yeah, he had that, and no one even really wanted to fight him for any of it. No, you know they waited till he went to jail, split his belts up, and were like, okay, now we could make money again because this dude is just killing everybody, and he's knocking everybody out within ninety seconds. You know, and people are like paying less on the pay per view. Because they don't want to spend all that money for like a ninety Two second, second fight. fight? Yeah. Unless yeah, it was sure. Jake Paul getting knocked out. Yeah, well, that's that's not even what we're talking right. about. What do you, come on, man. In the new fight, though, he might do that fight. He said, "Stop ruining the conversation." Oh, that's I mean, your. Oh, your, I see. Your, I see oh, what you're saying. Oh, I see yeah. what you're saying. Okay, in in that context, yes. But yeah. back in his time when he was primed up, all these all, all the pay per view things was that extra money that they were caking up on, and he was threatening that by knocking all these dudes out. Because they were eighty to a hundred yeah. bucks. Because you had to go through like four or five yes. like 
decent fights. Some of them really good. Yeah. Don't get me wrong. But you had to wait all that time, and then for Mike to come out and just give it to the guy and yeah. like, like, I mean, bam, you Blake, you might have, you might have went to, to to say something to somebody, and at that time Mike had him knocked out right there. Oh, you paid twelve hundred dollars, you know, for your ticket, depending on where you're sitting. Probably even more expensive than that when you're like ringside. Mm. Yo, before, before, before but more than that, they, they don't give a damn about. Well, they do, but I mean, in comparison. They're worried about the pay-per-view people. Yeah. Because those are, like, I'm not paying $159 for this dude to just come and knock the guy out in right. 60 seconds. No way. My pops paid for that Michael Spinks oh, fight. Oh, man. The Spinks fight, and everybody came over for it, and it was 80 to 100 bucks. And back then, that was a lot. And a sp- lot. And, and Spinks pretty much, like, he didn't get hit as hard as a lot of the other guys got hit. Right. He just knew, like, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna sit my ass right I'd stay down, there. I, right think there. More, I think it was 45 I, seconds. I ain't even put, I ain't even getting up for this party because like yeah. he already knew just by what he what he had taken in that shot. Yeah. He wasn't as bad as he as he could have been. And he knew right then, you know what? This guy could have this. Yeah. I'm done. I think it was 45 seconds. <laughs> 45 seconds. Something and how that. much money did yeah, people spend to go watch I mean. that in person? But more than anything, the pay-per-view the Pay-per-view. People. Yeah. Because they're the ones that complain more than anything. Because yep. like, if you're there, you get the experience, the experience of being there when mm-hmm. it happened. But on pay-per-view, you're at home expecting to get your money's worth. And my dude was just, yeah, he was no. so good Boop. and so solid and Bye-bye. so dominating that like people couldn't like their money's worth was like ninety seconds. Yeah, that, that body shot is deadly. <laughs> Dude, I can't tell you. How yeah, many... you took that to the ribs. Get out of here. You can't breathe. You're going right down. Dude, the amount of times my mom got a few of those when yeah. we were kids. The amount of times she got pissed because it was like, "What do you mean it's over?" Yep. I paid this amount. Of... I just I... went to the kitchen. Yeah, I just went to go get some. What? It's over. Oh, yeah, so. you might have went to go get a drink in the refrigerator thinking, you know, <laughs> oh, boy, might last at least one. No. Nope. You could have sneezed, and in that time, Mike dropped the guy. <laughs> Dude. Oh, man. And imagine the people that are there that pay for it to be in person, right? Like, it takes you longer to get to your seats than the, than the duration of the fight. Word. I, you know, I, <laughs> you know I, 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 I honestly like sometimes it. as a fan, like, feel like, that like he was purposely derailed because he he was that threat to the money. Yeah, he could make a promoter a lot of money, but in terms of the pay per view, which is the bigger picture these days, because you can okay, so ticket sales right, they're subject to the capacity of the building. And let's say they sell that out, whatever they make in terms of the vendors that are there and in, in the the what do they call it um. You know the concession areas and all that stuff. Mm-hmm. The building makes money. The you know ticket sales and concessions and all that stuff, merch sales and all that stuff. But really, the money is in the pay per view, due to you know the the <clears throat> the sponsors and adverts and all that stuff that go into that, and then the reach. Yeah. Of how many homes that that could get into? Millions. Yeah. Millions, yeah. millions globally. Yeah. 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 Now, yeah. when you're a threat to that, where people say, like, "I'm not gonna pay for this," he's gonna knock yeah. dude out in 30 seconds. That- I'm gonna pay 159 dollars for 30 seconds for the fight I really want to watch. Yeah. I'm gonna watch all this filler stuff, but like the fight I really want to watch is gonna. Go like twenty to thirty <laughs> seconds. Why am I paying for that now? Nah. Yeah, that and and that's where they. To me, I I feel like that's they were afraid of that, yeah. Because there was nobody in his prime, even at the time when he went to jail, even with the the you know when he had like the not not as great trainer as he was used to having, he was still that guy, and he would have he would have continued to to bang dudes out in that ring. Oh, yeah. You know, like with with without hesitation, without <laughs> fail, he would have gave it yeah. to most dudes. I mean, he lost that one with Buster, but that's because he didn't take dudes serious yep. and he was partying and not yeah. not following his normal protocol. But you get him back on track. Word. No one was was gonna do that again. Cree was on cruise control for that yeah. fight. But you know, what was it, Buster then Lennox after that who beat him? Well, well, no, Buster beat him and then he went to jail. 
Right, but then the next fight was Lennox Lewis, I think. Mm, I don't know if it was Lennox later. Lewis. Lennox Lewis, I think, came after yeah. um, after Evander. Yeah, oh, because well. <clears throat> because um, Mike came out and fought, I think, Bruce Seldon or somebody. Yeah, Lennox. Before that fight, he knocked Bruce Seldon out quick. <clears throat> Man. Yeah, that whole Bruce Seldon like was fanboyed out on him. You know what I mean? He was mm-hmm. like, "Oh my God, I'm fighting Mike Tyson." Yeah. <laughs> oh my <laughs> God, and then he, and then he thought, "Oh my God, I'm fighting." Mike Tyson. <laughs> yeah, it goes one side <laughs> of the corner to the other. Yeah, yeah. You go from yeah, to, oh, <laughs> oh, and that was uh, you know, and anyone that was there that had been watching Bruce Seldon, you thought if anybody <laughs> could maybe put up a fight. It's, him. it's this dude because yeah. you know he was pretty good, but not that night. Not that night. Nah. Not that night. Mike got him. Yeah. Mike got him as he walked into the ring. It was just like he explains in his documentary. Like he's when he walks to the ring, the guy sees him, and he already knows he got him. He's scared, and I'm a god. <laughs> that like he put it in in those type of words. You know what yeah. I mean? And. Bobo and I were at this fight. We saw it, Oof. and it was like boom, over in a heartbeat. Just yeah, if you go to to the bar, get a beer, you, you missed it. Done. Yeah. Yeah. Gone. Yeah. Bobo was one of those like he he turned to talk to somebody. Rook. What happened? <laughs> Went to the bathroom. <laughs> it's done. It's out of here, Papi. It's over. Yastuvo. Yeah. That was pathetic. <laughs> Between uh, and Bruce was a good fighter. He just was going up against a great. Fighter. Yo, that was that was rare, right? Like to knock people out in the first round before Tyson, right? <laughs> it, it happened, but not as frequent. Not as much, right? Yeah, with you know who had a lot of first round knockouts. Sorry, see, but was um um our bro um Cannon. Yeah, Briggs. Shannon the Cannon Briggs. He had a lot of a lot of first yeah. round knockouts. Uh, yep. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> Let's go, champ. What were you going to say? I was going to say, I don't think there's been anybody that's, uh, I mean, when I came as a kid growing up and, you know, hearing about, you know, Sugar Ray Leonard and Marvin Hagler and all that, it was about this boxing match of skill. Right? Yeah. Like, you know, it w- if you got the quick knockout, it was cool. Everyone would be like, whoa, but Tyson would go in there with the purpose of just destroying his opponent and like, yeah, this is what I came to do. And the thing was is that he had brutal hands, but Ooh. like. The, but his boxing skills were on the one because he was a student. You know what I mean? Like that's what a lot of people don't talk about. It that like this is his actual boxing skills were phenomenal. Like Tyson? his yeah. Oh, bro! Like C- his Customato was like yeah. one of the best trainers. His reaction time and footwork and his shifting. I mean, it's like martial arts yeah. type of you know skill type level. of Damn. skill level. Yeah, like when you when you see him training in there with Rooney, right? And you see him shifting like his footwork. Other boxers didn't have that, except for maybe Muhammad Ali and Sugar Ray Robinson and yeah. Sugar Ray Leonard and guys like that. Like their precise footwork like that. Psh. And his was just on another level. Low to the ground. He just knew how to use his weight. I mean, that's why his punches were so devastating. And he got in and out so fast. So fast. TCB like all day. Word. You know what I mean? He just went taking care of business. Just went in there with the sole purpose of yeah. just annihilation. I I want to say out. I want to say this. I'm gonna take this five, right? And I know I don't owe it, but you say I do, so I'm gonna take your word for it because I know I didn't start with. But if I look back at the tape, I don't want to be like, mm, I did. Like, so I'm gonna take that five just on GP, all right? I don't think I owe it, but it, I'm gonna look back at the tape. And if and if 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 in fact Callie and I did not, then you're gonna owe it. And we want to see all y'all that said that we yes. owe. We, we're gonna we want to watch y'all flip it. And you're gonna have to go <laughs> to our Discord, and we're gonna have to see you do five flips. That's right. True. All right. So all y'all accusing us, we're gonna go back. I'm gonna take the five, <laughs> but we're gonna go back. I owe 10 because I know I did curse once. You did curse once. You did. But you know, but you've been really good. Yes, yeah. sir. Thank Stay you. on track, Fine. son. Stay on track. I only got six minutes. To six do it. minutes, Dougie Fresh, you're on. And please believe we could um, screenshot this, yes. this chat room here to see yeah. who was all mouthy about, like, you know, <laughs> we owe. Like, who was first? Because we, we could definitely check. Yes. 
Utah Hawk is now saying you might owe 10. Be real. No. Ah. I, someone else said I too. definitely don't owe 10. Yeah. I'm There's no that. way I owe 10. Nah, I didn't. <clears throat> C minus is usually my 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 mark. <laughs> He'll look at me I when can't. I've caused the blunder there. And he has not looked at me once, not even in the first accusation of <laughs> such such a thing. It's true. All of it. True. Yes. True. So, so Utah Hawk, I don't know. You better rewind the tape, bro. Yeah, I don't know. I would, because I would have been the first to be like, yeah, like I get. There's this look I, there's this smirk I give him. I'm like, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I know. <laughs> well, you oh, better tell man. Ezo in that too. He C- says B owes ten. No, I don't believe anything he says. <laughs> <laughs> That's the boy who cries wolf. I'm not like Ooh. ever gonna believe what he says. You, I'll tell you what. Go back to the part. The two parts you're saying that I owe, <laughs> screenshot them and send them to Bolton. I'm, I told you I'm going to do five right now just because you're saying all this these right. things. Um, believe me, I can't wait till this ends because yeah. I'm going to give it to you. He, he just did to, the radio edit right now. That was you're trying to accuse me of some. Mm. Yeah. Hey, fuck, <laughs> fuck that. Oh, that's uh, five for you, Liz. Oh, that's cursed. Uh, oh, you want a shot? shot. He's, he's, like, yeah. uh, he's like, forget uh, them flips. Give me that shot, Papo. <laughs> he's which like, I'm one thirsty. You, which one you want, Poppy? Brown brown juice. Oh, you want the juice. Yeah. I'm fired up, boy. I'm fired I like how you threw your hands up <laughs> like, about to do it. Oh, God. Jeez Louise. Oh, man. Oh, <laughs> squeeze. <laughs> Yeah, man. I'm excited I'll, for They the should record up. that sound. I'm excited for the Mama Boom. Wana to come through. Hmm? The Mama Wana. Mm, yeah. <coughs> that seems like a new drink. <laughs> MB, you told me some really, uh, really rad. Uh, you told me the <laughs> when I walked in this morning, you were like, caught the last episode of Ozark. <laughs> oh, I did. Oh, baby. I did. Woo! I got one left. Oh, come on, man. Yeah, let's talk about it. <laughs> I got to leave. Let's talk Who about do you it. it. I got one left. Go. Been, I'll come back a, in two minutes. It's been a week. I know, but I still can't uh, leave. You can talk about it. We'll wait. Two minutes. We'll wait. We'll wait. We'll wait. Sure we'll yes, I don't yes, want to yes, ruin yes. it for everybody. Just, no. I can't hear the end. Okay. I'll die. You know what we got to have, I think, here, <laughs> when we're going to do something like that? I have an idea. We're going to get the headphones that are sound blocking. And we're going to make the person who hasn't watched you all the way sit in the seat over there. I would do it now if you hadn't said it. Well, we don't have it, so you lucked out to yeah. good. Hey, um, but but yes, thank you, though, guys. It was, a nice, it was a nice ramp up. You're going to enjoy it. I can't wait tonight. Yeah. Hey, man, it was just, I mean. Uh, let me take that there you go, bro. off your hands for a minute, um, B. And we were talking about, like, how Jason Bateman and Laura Linney and the kids and and the actress that played Ruth, excellent actors. You know yeah, what I mean? Absolutely. You, you know, Laura Linney was the psycho. Who's that? That's the wife. Oh, Wendy. Wendy? She's Wendy. great. One of the best actors in the whole show. But just see, like, all the way till the end. You oh, know I what can't I mean? wait. Where, she, where she's just, you know I what I mean? I can see in it's, this last episode where she's going, like, yeah. she's losing it. So, yeah. Yeah, 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 that's the, I mean. Oh, yeah, it, it, it culminates in great. Good. I can't wait. I thought the ending was dope. Oh, good to yeah. hear. And good. Jason Bateman, man, what a great actor. Love him. And yeah, he's, he's great. He wrote a lot of it, and uh, oh, he was uh, one of the writers and one of the directors, too. Awesome. I hear a lot That's of people. Great. Jason Bateman putting it work. <coughs> man, he's the man, man. I hear a lot of people watching Ozark, and even if you bring it up, it seems like everybody checks it out, but nobody will tell me it's their favorite show. It's one of my favorites. It's one, one of, of my, my favorites. I put it up there with I hate to Breaking see it Bad. Go. It's great. I hate to see it go because yep. it's really good. Yeah, and it was uh, the crazy thing is without getting there's so many open ended things at the end. It could, but they're talking about that it's not <coughs> going to happen, which I think is rad. Like leave it open and let your imagination go. What would happen if this is <coughs> Wendy and the kids or yeah, you know yeah, what whatever. I mean? Yeah, it's uh, it's brilliant. Yeah, I've never seen this, but uh, is Wendy like evil or? Yeah, oh yeah, she oh, is evil. Oh, oh yeah, she is. Woo! Wendy Marie is evil. Hey, you haven't seen it? No, I Bolton? haven't. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Does that not look evil to you? Hey, what a <laughs> ride. Hey, I'm telling you, man, I envy you in the sense is that this ride yes. from beginning to end yes. is one of hey. the best. Oh, wow. That's Bolton's aunt right there. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> you got some game from uh, Wendy Bird. Auntie Wendy. <coughs> Auntie. No, I'll have to check it out. Yeah, it's really good. That's Bolton Bird in there. <laughs> <laughs> 
That was a strong Excuse sleep. Excuse me, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Be easy on my kid. Dude, and I'm really excited. May 27th. That's 10, all right? There you go. Kenobi. Kenobi. Yeah, yeah, that's going to be good. The Ooh. trailers for it have been off the chain, son. Yeah, and Stranger Things on the same day. Word. That's Did you strange. hear how much it cost to make one episode of Stranger Things, they said? It was like... Lots of money. 3.5 million episode. I mean, the special effects that they use, though. Yeah. It was just wild numbers. I was like, man, they must be making that times 100 then. Yeah, I mean, and they're going to do the same thing that the Ozark did. They're going to do the first half of the season. And then release. And the then other. release in July. Mm-hmm. Or, or uh, I, mean, I think it's July. They're going to release the other half. I actually like done. when they do that. Yeah. Because we binge watch it. We go through it, and then it's fucking gone. Oh. Yeah, fuck, 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 <laughs> fuck. Right on 2.30. Yeah, you did it. I just looked down when I said it. I'm like, oh. Yeah, that was perfect. Oh, you got, you did you got lucky. Yeah. Uh, you, you got, got lucky, lucky oh, babe. <laughs> nice. I hey, found you. So I want you know to say this shortly. In the next 10, 15 minutes, we'll be having Faith Evans up in yeah. here. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. The legendary. Yep. Um. So we look forward to having her up in here. Spread the word. Tell yeah. your friends. You know what I'm saying? Let them know. Sharing um, shit. Sharing shit. Super you know? chat. Super chat them. Super chat them. You know what I'm Impress saying? us with your knowledge. Yeah. yeah. Let's go. What? Yes. Hey, Faith is one of my favorites as far as like singers. Woo! And be respectful. God damn it. Hey, her, her discography is so tight. Yeah. I mean. <laughs> She's a legend. legend. Yeah. She, got, she got legendary work out there, no doubt. Right. 100. And uh, yeah, it's going to be good. And, and just legacy of relevance, you know what I mean? She's still popping today. Yeah. Like, everything she does makes headlines. They've been doing Love and Hip Hop ATL. Uh, yeah. She won, like, uh, New York Times bestseller with her book. Yeah. Wild career. Yeah, man. And her voice is rad. It is. Damn. It's super rad. That first album, though, I'm telling you. If anyone wants to go hear a really rad, like, like one of my favorite R&B albums ever, it's that first favorite. Evan's album, just I think it's simply titled "Just Faith." It's a good one. Yeah. Woo. Yeah, I gotta listen to it later. She she like was the voice of the early two thousands for R and B, like. And late, yeah, her and, and Mary late 90s. and late nineties. Her and Mary, yeah, yes, oh her Mary, Mary. For sure. Hey, when they worked together on that My Life, Mary J. Best, I, the best. Bro. Man, I'm telling you. Yeah. That My Life album was made uh, to me. The, the Mary album and the First Faith album. Am I can't looking, fuck with them. Am I looking at this right, Kyle? What was it, 411? Was mm. Mary? Uh, well, there was the My Life album that Faith oh, yeah, worked on. And the, what, Mary was 411? What's the 411? Yeah, that's was the that first the album. It, that was right? her first album. That was album. dope. Yeah. Am I looking at this right? It says half a ton of cocaine worth yep. over 50 million found in coffee bean delivery to Nespresso plant. Yeah, so yep. <laughs> oh there was a coffee bean delivery from Brazil to Germany to the Nespresso. We, we're we a very big Nespresso family here. We are. That's all we drink. <laughs> so um, Wonder was it. It was tucked in there, and they said the warehouse workers actually like discovered it and like kind of gave the tip off like, hey, there's some... Some crazy powdery stuff in this. Oh, they're oh. going to do an investigation. Look at, oh, yeah, look at that, dude. And then so they had to release a statement because, you know, why do people drink Nespresso for energy, right? So they had to put out a <laughs> statement saying that, like, the Coke Cocaine's did not drug, touch though. any of their machinery, their products. But, like, Cali Blaze was saying, he's like, they should have said nothing. And people would have been buying Nespresso like crazy, be like, uh, stocking up. I'm still this buying it. Fuck yeah. all like, that. Can I, get that <laughs> can I get that Brazil bag? Where's Let me get that Brazil, Brazil bag, man. We're going to slag that shit over here twice yeah. for hey. twice the amount. No wonder why you guys are always like, ooh, I need an Espresso after exactly. the show. <laughs> Cocaine's a hell of a drug. Though. I don't know if you know this, Joe Rogan, but I love Nespresso. Uh, <laughs> I thought I heard rumblings in the nest. <laughs> mm. Not yet. No, no. He said, I'm holding it down. He's he said calling he's, him. He's, he's, yeah, he says, I'm waiting for him, too. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Quit breaking my balls. Yeah. Easy snacks. He got a <laughs> snack. Just check it. Snacks got a show tomorrow. Yeah, yep. Snacks got a show with the LAFC tomorrow. Yep. Yes. It's a big game. It is, because it's two best teams. We're going to be in the building. Yes. Chia. Chia. And then, and then we got Madre's Day. Yep. yep. Mother's, Sunday. Mother's Day. Mother's. Word to your mother's Word day. Word to your mother's day. Yeah. Uh-huh. 
Mother's Day is dope. You get to just see everybody trying to be nice. Ah, uh, but you it's think everyone is nice. Yeah, what do you mean trying? <laughs> yeah. yeah, I thought you loved everyone. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude. I'm just I mean, observing the people. Nice. People are more kind on Mother's Day. Like you, 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 you interact with people, and people are just kind of like you know they get that mom check sure. in their head, and they're like, "Yo, I gotta be, I gotta be a decent human being and make my mother proud." Sure. That should be every day. It yeah. should be every day, but not everybody does it. Yeah, but mm. I think, you know, everyone that really loves and ha to hang out with their mom, as soon as they get with their mom, you know, they go hang out. They're on their best behavior regardless. Mm -hmm. Yeah, right. Because you're not trying to be an asshole or a dick, you know, around your mom. And, like, you want to bring that energy. Like, hey, mom. All I know is Mother's Day, the wait times at any place to eat are, like, the worst. If you don't have reservations, like oh, yeah. you messed yeah. up. And if you're trying yeah. to go somewhere nice to take your mother, definitely make your reservations last week. You become motherfucker. Word. Yeah. Learn how it to cook. It curves into motherfucker. Day. <laughs> Learn how to cook and make her a nice meal. It's even easier and better. That's how I do. Man, yeah, look at this. Right. Because you're all it's yeah, true. It's easier. You ain't wrong. It is yeah. easier. Chef it's Boy less of a Blaze. production, man. No, nah, Blaze, man, your cooking is amazing. The dude. pasta? Thank you, brother. Hey, your pasta? Yeah, I don't want to be caught up on one dish, bro. I do a lot, man. I'm just saying. that was Don't be like... make me a one trick pony. Nah, you got to pay one, attention one, to your one stories. One trick pony. Yeah, come on, man. Nah, your stories <laughs> show your diversity when Thank it comes you, to the man. Cook, cooking, hey, the, man. The, um, <laughs> the food your your wife made, what was the beef with the Oh, uh, the ropa, ropa vieja. vieja. Yeah, I can't. Yeah. I was about to remember that. But yeah, that was fire. Put Chipotle to shame. All right, hold up. Wait. Bolton. Ropa. Oh. Ropa. <laughs> Ropa. Yeah. Ropa. Ropa. Vieja. Ropa. You got the vieja, right? Got Ropa. The vie vieja. <laughs> Look at Ray. Ray. Yeah. Yeah. Ropa. Vieja. Yeah. Vieja. Yeah. Vieja. Vieja. <laughs> There's no vie. There's vie. Vieja. Look at vieja. Come on, man. Vieja. 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 There you go. Oh, there you go. Hey. hey. Ray hey. Clap. Hey. There you go. Hey, yo. Ray, yeah. Ray got those SoCal bro tips right there. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, baby. It's almost, it's almost like, yeah. 420 today, <laughs> Funky yeah. Field Tips. That's right. Today we're dropping these SoCals right here. SoCal, yeah. Because they're so Cali. They're so awesome. So dope. The colors are so just the wave. So yes. Uh, at 420 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, 720 Eastern, uh, these drop yeah. at www.funkyfieldtips.com. Yeah. And there's two sizes. Right. Yeah. So if you're trying to don't just order one and be like, oh, I didn't know there was a 10 milli. Get try to order both. Yeah. So. Right Word up. It's, it's a pair. It's salute to uh, our sponsor of today's show, CBD Lion. Um, Rawr. 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 Some of mm -hmm. the best C CBDs in the game right here. <laughs> what are you going back to me for? <laughs> Go to CBDLion.com. And uh, check the menu. They got Delta 8 and 9 products, gummies, edibles, tinctures, Topicals, flour, hemp flour, CBD full spectrum capsules, broad spectrum capsules, isolate products, broad and full spectrum products, com CBD combos, bundle packs, pet tinctures and treats and all that stuff. That was kind of dyslexic right in there the way I said it, but you know what the fuck I mean. Go to CBDLion.com and check out the bathing bombs. Bombs. You take baths. Sold out. Soak and toke. Yeah. They go fast, so um, you know you gotta act fast. So when they restock, get some of these. Go to cbdline.com. Use coupon code Be Real on your purchase to get a discount. I right. man, there we go. CBD line. Cheers. Somebody said that at the beginning. They went back and looked, and we both said, "What the fuck is that?" So that's what. Uh, I don't know what to. I hear it to what? That's what I don't know. But they said it. I went back and looked, and you guys both said, "What the fuck is that?" Oh. So we might have been looking at something, or I don't know. Huh. I didn't remember it, man. I really did yeah. not remember doing it. I that guess. Right. Subconscious. Well, I did the 10. Yeah, we did it anyway. So, so guess what? Y'all can we fuck paid. off. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Fuck off and go to hell. That's right, brother. All right. <laughs> I was going to say next right now. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> Yep. Oh yeah, man. Hey, did you hear what Chris Rock said? No. Oh, it's the best. No. Oh yeah. Yeah, it's pretty fucking ice cold. It's ice cold as all that ice cold could be. Cold. I mean, because he's been very tight-lipped about any reaction to the Will Smith, Will Smith slap, right? These last few days, not so much. Not so much. 
even in the show, just you know, Chris Rock was one of the performers. Yeah, he, he didn't speak about it. Yeah, yeah. Dave Chappelle did, <laughs> but <laughs> but Chris Rock did not. He refrained from yeah. any of that comedy. He actually did. Yeah. But then Dave Chappelle brought up the situation. His side of it made it funny. You know yeah. What I mean, yeah. Yeah. I, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Chris Chris Rock did it. What he, did he? he, he you want to tell him what he said? Yeah. Do you, or do you want to tell him? No. I don't. He said know. he got slapped by the softest. Bitch ass rapper of all time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he said the softest. Not exactly what yeah, he said. That's not, yeah, that's not verbatim. You, okay. He said he got slapped. He got slapped uh, by the softest expletive, expletive. rapper to ever. Yeah. No, that. Yeah, softest. Expl- <laughs> yeah. Start out letters. I don't know how you how you want to label that. I don't think YouTube. <laughs> I don't think YouTube's gonna rock with that. Yeah. But yeah, man, like that's it's funny. It, it was on point because Will Smith doesn't have to cuss to sell records, but Eminem does. So, but, well, I mean, it's just also just getting jiggy with it slapped you. I mean, <laughs> Wild Wild West slapped you. Oh, summertime oh, slapped you. Hey, it really made me. Summertime's con- great. It, it really did make me reflect on Nick Cannon's rap career, though, because if like Will Smith's getting that record, then they're like, well, who, who's Nick Cannon now? Because Nick Cannon was had some of the softest raps. Of all time, I'm sorry, Chris. I'm sorry, Chris Rock, but Nick Cannon. <laughs> you know what I mean? Damn. His, he had Gigolo though, but that song's canceled. You can't play it no more. I mean, obvi. Yeah, it's a <laughs> you know producer. There's been a lot of soft raps. Those aren't the only ones. But he said softest of all Ever. time. Of all time. Mm, I don't know. Cali Blaze. What about it? Who would you consider the softest of all time? I yeah, who? Get, yeah, who would? Who do you think? Aton. No, no, he don't he's count. Not a rapper. Come on, let's see. It's a cheap shot. He's no, I thought that's what Callie was gonna say. Unprovoked. So many of them, but I gotta be honest with you. He's definitely in the top. Who? Will Smith, man. He really, really? definitely. Okay. This, it, I, you know, Dad. I don't know if it was soft as as so soft. much happy. He had a song with Sister. that is soft and hip hop. Happy is soft. It was in the nineties. Yeah, yes, that, that was, was considered soft. I'm it not, wasn't. N- considered happy right. it was considered soft but if you look back parents don't, don't it, it was more upbeat and happy yes which at that time Fun. was, was soft. soft word <laughs> as up, we man. go back full circle yep it is and real talk like back then i couldn't back that music I would, even if summertime was yeah a good I, didn't, song, I, I would never let you hear the me. only song i ever really like listened to there was only two yeah really mm-hmm. was was the first joint you know um the very first joint with the magnificent or uh jazzy jet girls ain't nothing but trouble. the girls ain't nothing oh yeah but trouble. right right that yeah. and Me then too. I, I, and then eventually summertime yeah summertime's rad yeah summertime was cool Brand new funk for me. Yeah, they had a lot of joints, man. But he got joints. He got it's joints. Just, it's yeah. just Jazzy you know, Jeff is one when of you the guys best, were man. older at that yeah. time, so you were allowed to like it. I was still in my upper teens. Yeah, yeah, when you, was, you was you was Wu Tang. Yeah, yeah, you could yeah. not yeah. be listening See, to summertime. We you remember. Know. Yeah, that's that. In, in a lot of circles, you it, didn't it, give a fuck. In a lot of circles, it was like that. If you listen to the hard shit, you didn't really listen to them. You appreciate. I appreciated what he did and respected him, but. It wasn't like something I was listening to. Right. Deep. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. a, a few joints right. throughout, yes, but Absolutely. not like yeah. the whole. I'll, I'll say this the first three albums, uh, the first two albums, like uh, Rock the House and uh, He's the DJ, I'm a Rapper, um, those records, fire. I mean, and we remember also, you know, from Girls Ain't Nothing But Trouble. So he bubbled for a second, but that then parents, all right, man. parents just didn't understand, to took them to a yeah. whole other level. And that was a dope song, too. Yeah, yeah. yeah that was a household song. Yeah. Everybody yeah, had that. That's a, the iconic song right there to this hey. day. Yeah. You know, I don't I don't want to piss anybody off, but, like, you know, a lot of uh, hip-hop enthusiasts of, like, the like or origins of hip-hop, they'll say, like, modern-day rappers, they'll try to label Drake as the softest rapper because he always makes... Some songs that are soft, I feel like he balances out. He still has the. I mean, also soft is a perception, right? Like yeah. it's what yeah, you what consider. Right. Like what do you consider soft compared to hard? As far as in hip hop, you know what I mean. Obviously, mm-hmm. like rough. There's the rough, rugged. You know, it, it, raw. It's all subjectable. Ugh. Yeah. Some people don't like the raw, hard shit. Right. In the cool. first place, so that's why the lanes are so plentiful with different styles of this shit. You know what I mean? Like. Yeah. People that liked MC Hammer may have not liked uh, Cypress Hill or, or at the time Run DMC and <coughs> and all that. 
Yep. No very sense. possible. Yeah. <laughs> very possible. And, and and vice versa, right? You right. know, the people that Correct. were listening to Run DMC, they definitely weren't listening to MC Hammer. Maybe they shared a small percentage of fans that were like open minded to everything, but a lot of us were very close minded. Like right. yeah. some of us were such purists that we didn't listen to any other genre that we like once we locked into this hip hop shit, we sort of locked the stuff that we grew up off off of out Correct. and just focused on this. Oh man. And 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 that happened to a lot of us. So like when you know growing up off that hard shit, that's all we want to hear. Like all that happiness that we don't live Wasn't that happening. And you know yeah. what? Like once the same thing like in in my era is especially because in my teen years is when Gangsta rap was at its peak from 91 to shit, even all the way up through the upper 90s. But yeah. at that time, if you were somebody who listened to hip hop, you were listening to some dark shit. And if you were, you weren't listening. And if you did, you listened to that shit at home. You right. didn't talk about it. Yeah, you didn't really talk about it. I was, grow I, was <laughs> I grew up with a lot of different types of music. So I always did like a lot. You wouldn't catch me telling my boys that I like this. I'd be like, ah, it's bullshit. Meanwhile, in the back of my head, I'm like, yeah, yeah it's a yeah. good track. Be, that, but I didn't that, talk that, about that, it. That, that first joint, yeah. when they flipped the, the uh, I Dream of Genie. Yeah. Yes. yes. Come on. That was yeah. classic. When yeah. that came on, them speakers with them drum, boom, bam, boom, boom. Yo, I had, that, yeah. no, they you had were, I, boom. We, I was a kid, so I yeah. was like, yeah. No, they had on, bangers that's... for sure. But, yeah. like, yeah. you know, there was harder shit out there to listen to. Yeah. For sure. And for, for some of us, man, we, we listened to the harder That's shit. That's right. But and we was... appreciated when that came on. You know, like, in the mix, it wasn't like we was fast-forwarding the shit. Right. But, mm -hmm. like, you know, we were, we were you know, I think more appreci appreciative of the, the harder-based hip-hop. Yes. That grimy, that grimy dark shit. I, I definitely know I was. I mean, fuck, man. I wouldn't listen to anything else for a long <clears> time. <throat> I closed I closed my ears to a lot of shit for a long time, man. Like, yeah. I stopped listening to things I used to listen to just to listen to hard. That's right. You know yeah. what I considered raw hip hop. Yeah. yeah. And you know what? It's you have to grow out of that because you're 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 you you're jipping yourself <laughs> you of do. such a great experience because. There's such great music out there that people are too close minded. Oh, listen to that shit. Well, give it a chance. Maybe you'll get a vibe from a certain song and say, oh, shit, that's pretty dope. I like that. You got to be open minded. Yeah. Music is beautiful. Enjoy, oh, yeah. enjoy all forms of yeah, music. Man. You, you know, what taught me a lot was of learning, you know, because like you said, when once you committed to hip hop, it was like a tunnel vision with it. Like we all just got really, it was like if it wasn't hip hop, I wasn't really trying to hear it. But yeah. I paid attention to other music. Right. But when you started, for me, when I started digging for records and trying to find samples of certain songs, you start listening to, you start, oh, that is this record. And you listen, you're like, oh, well, that there's other songs on here. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. You find a rock group that, you know, used a certain break, you know, they get, provided a break for someone. And then you just go, okay. Yeah. Word, oh, I like this album. This album's you know, dope. You know who did a lot of that to me? Beasties. Because Beastie used so many uh, classic beats from Led Zeppelin to... Oh, yeah. Uh, 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 what's his name? Curtis. Curtis Mayfield. Curtis Mayfield. Mm -hmm. Like, they sampled so many big classic Beatles. hits. That, Beatles. that you go back and you're like, yo, that's a dope loop. And then you check that track and you're like, yeah. yo, the original's dope. That's why they sampled it. Dude, the greatest compliment I've ever seen anyone pay the Beasties was Hank Shockley of the Bomb Squad, who produced all the Public Enemy and did all, the, like, you know, Ice Cube's first record. He proclaimed Paul's Boutique to be the Bible of breakbeats. Yeah. He was like... Yo, that big, album, big inspiration. It was me on the production tip. Yeah, definitely, I know. love Paul's boutique. Yeah, yeah my dude. favorite. Definitely. Oh yeah. Paul's boutique got oh. so many breaks and so many. Just it's like all the different like. Yeah. I mean, they sampled the Beatles more you, than once. If, if you listen to our first album, The Street Level, it's like that kind of, in our own way, like a lot of breaks just popping in and out, boom, 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 and we got that from Beasties. Dude, yeah. That idea, you know? Yeah, Paul's Boutique. Oh, man. yeah, Paul's Boutique was ill. True. Yeah. That's like a slept-on album. Ooh, it's one of the dopest hip-hop albums in yeah. terms of production and just the way the Beastie Boys delivered that. And yeah. the, all the different types of sounds, the introduction yeah. of rock and hip-hop together was just... And the way they were playing off each other, off all those, you know what back, I mean? And, like, and back then, the good thing was the, the sampling was they it, you were still... You didn't have to clear it. So. Wild Wild West. Yeah, you was getting away with, with a lot. It, it's crazy how, how their shit went, 
right? Because like their first album, boom, it pops, it like yeah. does great. And then their second album comes out <clears throat> and <clears throat> it's critically acclaimed, but it dips a little bit, right? Because yeah. it goes over the head of some folks. And then their fucking third one comes and they smash people in the head with that shit. It, and then they smash another one and it kept smashing. Yeah, Woo. it kept smashing. Man, one of the things I always heard that they were gonna do, and I'd wish that I would have got it. You know, they would have done it, and I would have had a ch chance to witness it. I heard they were gonna do like albums incomplete, like you know, like full albums on tour, like. And Paul's Boutique was up for one of the records that they were going to do live, like as a whole one oh, shot, wow. I, like from beginning to end. I think I hear the night hop. I hear, I hear the rattle. Oh, they call it. There, there oh. it goes. Hello. I heard that rattle. Yo. What's up, B? What's up, man? What's up, B? Eep. Eep. What's up, Eep? Yeah. Uh, uh, Snack says it's about time. Man, I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry, man. I was running a little, happened, a little behind. The he bus, said, a, the he bus said, was late. He said, don't you ever. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I just walked in with faith. All right. Oh, so, oh, so you have belief now. <laughs> <laughs> You're a believer. <laughs> He's a believer. That was you good. like that? That uh, was good. Uh, there should have been a rib shot there. Oh, I know. No. That. <laughs> We're about to bring faith in. Let's go into a break and we'll, you know, come on in. Hell yeah. Or anywhere else online. Palm Springs, California, I come to check you out. A buyer every time, insane OG, you gotta grab some of it. LAX, Dr. Green, I'm opening, baby, live and direct. Check it out on B-Roll TV. Yeah. Enjoy yourself, ladies and gentlemen. The documentary is Insane in the Brain. Make some noise for Cypher King. Right? I must have been out of my mind. Tap in this, there's he been a few. He said it's. There's been a few tappers. I just like I just had to get my breathing <laughs> together. Like. There's been a couple of uncomfortable, you know, like sessions, but it was like. It wasn't like they was feeling uncomfortable with what we were doing. It's they got so high. Oh, and then, yeah, so and high. The smoke. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I'm saying. The smoke. And then start the, panicking. Yeah, this, you know, yeah. <laughs> we had <laughs> someone come in here and buckle their seatbelt while they were sitting there. We were like, what? <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> it's like, oh, shit. You yeah, be getting too high. They got to make sure they strapped down. <laughs> uh -huh. You be taking shrooms? Man, I'm, I, I, I kind of like, I feel like I brought shrooms out here. 
Like, yeah, because, you know, shrooms is a big thing now. Yeah. But early, when I was doing shrooms, because I was getting them from Amsterdam, because it wasn't really a lot of plugs. If you, like, you could find it when you like, find it. You go to Amsterdam, they got them still wet in the fridge, not dried out <laughs> in these, like, poles in these containers with, like, the menu that tell you different levels and what it do, and it was, like, like going oh, to the yeah. dispensary. So I yeah. was, like... At that point, I was like, yo, this is it. So I would always go out there on European tour. We'd probably do like two European tours a year. So when I would go, I would just load up. Load up, take yeah. Like 20 back to the house and just live off of them. Be Real, AKA Dr. Green Thumb in the San Diego La Mesa location, right here on 8760 Campo Road. It was popping off today. Um, if you weren't here, you fucked up. You guys sitting here and do this a lot. My eyes are fucking on fire. I do, man. Try not to cough. I'm trying my best not right. to cough. And then, two, <laughs> I try not to move around a lot. Yeah, right. You know what I'm saying? Little movements. <laughs> oh, no, I caught it. That's it. You're fucking out, man. You got to you gotta drown it with water, bro. Just take a sip water. of water, no. and then you're going to drown it, and you'll be all right. <laughs> we had... mm. We're having you know, that now. Ghosts and shit. <laughs> yeah, like, I mean, just overall, like, you never... <laughs> Oh my god, can somebody bring another water? Is it possible? Another water, guys! I'm dying in here. Another water! I haven't been in a hot box in so long. Oh, man. That's ice cold week. shit. That's <laughs> ice cold <laughs> shit right there. Ooh, I, you know, I remember back in the day, man, um, Adidas used to lace everybody up. <laughs> 
Yeah. They were the ones lacing every everybody up in hip hop, right? Yeah. Shout out and, Adidas. They used to take care of me. Yeah. Salute to Adidas. And Nike would not lace, and they give you one, one fucking thing. Yeah. Like that's it. Where Adidas would send you boxes of shit. You know, nah, to represent. Adidas used to let me run, right? They used to really be kind of a little bit more free, loose in there. Yeah. They used to run in there and they, yeah. in the warehouse. Yeah, in the warehouse. Yeah, let's see if they like that now that Yeezy did. Yeah. Good way, Yeezy first. That was that was that was, that was more near the end. Yeah, it was yeah. more the end. Yeah, it was, it was getting right when he, he pulled up. It, you know what it is? Changed, you know what's crazy is that it, it was like this, right? Nike didn't really give feel the need to give shit out to the hip hop community, like to any artist, right? Yeah. Because they had Michael Jordan, yeah, after, yeah. you know what I mean. Yeah, Mainly yeah, Michael Jordan, yeah, though. Yeah, he was selling. He was, yeah, he was selling everything. You know what I mean. So they didn't feel the fucking need to give you shit. So if you got something, hey, be happy with the one thing you got was their attitude Correct. towards us in hip hop, right? Yeah, yeah. Where Adidas were embracing us the whole fucking time, giving everybody a look, and you know letting everybody do them, but representing Adidas, right? Yeah. But when Yeezy came, that that was their Michael Jordan. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so they switched That up. was their Michael it's Jordan, up. switched it all up. We, hey, no more we don't really need y'all <laughs> motherfuckers. We got yeah. him. Yeah, yeah. And, yeah. you know. We can make a bop, a bop Yeezy in itself. Bro, that's what like, they was doing, like, too. Yeah, they they was definitely Yeezy doing that one. People wear no problem. True like, that. Look like the I feel they stopped putting in, like, effort into all the other, like, uh, models of shoes after once it gets oh, yeah. like a spokesman like I used to be in this like EQ, these EQTs I used to be comfortable oh, as fuck bro yeah. like comfortable yeah. Yeah. all of a sudden like oh, easy sales go over yeah. it's like yeah we, ain't, we don't even don't worry about those I can't find those just stop yeah, yeah, nah, those, they used to have other ones like yeah. Addy Zeros and all chains, them I like yeah. the two chains and they had some chain reaction joints back then the two chain uh, no they was called based on two story with the shit yeah. they had a couple of little shit yeah the EQTs I mean there's some free shit they would sit in you know out of the free it was kind of dope. Yeah, the EQTs yeah, make easy. you felt like you was floating when you was walking, man. Them shits had so much cushion in them. It was so much float. I gotta check the EQT. Oh man, they don't make them no more. Yeah, That's the thing. Uh, they stopped making them. You the can still ones? find them. Wasn't the other ones called like the NMDs? The NMDs. They still make NMDs. Still make but it's like, you, you could still no find EQTs like, online. Yeah, no effort, yeah, they don't put no effort into it. That's what I'm about to say. They not exclusive I mean, like how they used to be. They gotta know that all the they got, like a shoe company knows the the colors, the tones, the all that shit that's gonna be popping every year. So like just how Jordan makes these color tones to match every release for every year, every fucking shoe brand can do that. You know what I mean? They just that's just lack of effort. They gave up on the show talk. Or anywhere else online. Be real TV fool. Word up. Salo. You're watching Be Real TV, Dr. Green Thumb show. Right here on YouTube, Twitch, and Discord. Uh, Faith will be coming on pretty soon. She's getting ready, <clears throat> and she'll be on with us. You know what I'm saying? Yep. So uh, maybe we ought to get into some submissions right now. Real quick. While we're waiting on her. Let's go. We got Eric Bobo up at the tower. Eat, motherfuckers. It's safe to say motherfucker now. Yes. Fuck yeah. Is. What time is That's it? That's why you came late. <laughs> Actually having Gobo uh, out working for me, that's why he's late. That's how you got to do it. That's how you got to step in the room. Yeah. How right. you doing? <laughs> All right. First submission of the day, we got a bell up in here saying, smoking left coast extracts on the Dr. Green Thumb Connect. Dope. <laughs> All right. Get down. Connectivity. All right. Cali Blaze, what do you what do you rate that right there? Rating what? His stuff? Right. I don't know what's in it. It could be good. Like, yeah, I can't show a little out. gadget. Oh no, oh the gadget. <laughs> this, his rig and setup was good. Well his yeah, rig yeah. will yeah, do. For sure. I'm just fucking with you. No, he's good, man. His rig will do. <laughs> he's good, man. 
And we got Victoria Pistouche up in here. Audio X saying, got the new Soul Assassin's tit. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Pistouche. Yeah. Pistouche. Yeah. yeah. It's heavy duty. It's fucking heavy fucking duty. So heavy. And just a reminder to everyone, Bart's Barbecue tomorrow at Spoke Bicycle Cafe That's by right. the L.A. River. Don't miss out. 6 p.m. Don't miss out. It's goodness. Get there early. Ooh-wee. That's when you go, ooh-wee. Bang. Stop it. Yes. Bang. Stop yes, it. Sir. Get that out of my face. <laughs> Bart's good all that. Get it out. Quit all that. Too. Sorry we don't have any trays for you today, oh, Bobo. You. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. He's, he's got he's... trays for no one today. <laughs> no one. No, no trays. One. No trays. <laughs> And we got Blackwood GT up in here saying Mrs. Blackwood rolled her first ever funky. All what? right. Hey. Yeah. Yeah. Wah, 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 wah. Hey, that looks good. That is a very nicely rolled joint. And asking kidding? for a rating. Shh, that's easily a nine right there. Well, What's look that? at that big crinkle on the other side. Oh, I can't see the crinkle. See that right oh, there? Oh, but I it's an amazing Okay, joint where you're pointing hand. it out at, I'm yeah. covered by the light oh, and, and the doll, so I can't see that. You got to zoom it. All the way up. So it's it's just <laughs> right below there. the neck. Look there. Look right there. Oh, okay, there. there. Yes, but it's a great joint. For a first, okay, first time? For a, okay, then we're going to have to downgrade that to an eight. And for a first joint, it's a nine or a ten. Yes. Meaning for a first joint. For a first yeah. joint, yeah. That's yeah, that's crap. A, yeah. yeah. You yeah. can only get better. I mean, the line there um, looks a little not straight, but I mean, for the a, joint for, looks straight. For a first joint, and that's everything. <laughs> <laughs> Why well, give it an eight? What do you want me to yeah, fucking that's do? That's very high. All right. Yeah, I'm very high too. I, I can't even roll an eight. Nah, that's that's we great. know less. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm with you. Eight. Eight it is. <laughs> Next. <laughs> and next up in here, we got GE saying, write my joint. <laughs> mm. sure. Okay. Well, little shorty. Short yeah. shot. Sporty shorty. One, you need a, a longer paper. Yep. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You need the, which one's the one fourth? What is it? Mm -hmm. uh, that's a one hitter. But for the shorty that this is, that's a very good roll. Yeah, man. I like 7.5. Yeah. Yeah. I see that little pocket of yeah. weed. It's yeah. like coming out right there. And, the and paper. right at the neck too, there's yeah. like a little, little gap right there. Slight, yep. slight little shizzle right yep. there. Well, and, yeah. And the not even on the left of the paper. You know what I mean? It's a little sticking out. And there's weed on the side of the tip. Yeah, it's not a bad effort though. Right. But it's a good joint. You oh. clean it up, little places. We're good to go. All right, we're gonna uh, pause the submissions and bring on our special guest. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yes, yes. I guess yes. Eric Bobo. Oh, yeah. yeah. Hey. Oh, man. What up? Yeah. Up. Here you go. Yes. Hey. Hey. Heaven, heaven's in the building. Yeah. Icons in the house right there. Let's do it. We, le wow. we left you a joint over there if you smoke. You know what I'm saying? I don't really like joints. Oh, what, what would you like? We'll have it rolled up. You like blunts? How about a hemp wrap blunt? This is the blunt right here. Okay. Yeah, that's a, that's a blizzy right there. Yes, um, ladies and gentlemen, man, we got you know right. the legendary Faith Evans up in here, you know, Queen R and B. Yes, what? How yeah. official? I mean, you know, that's right. And look, she does so much. It ain't just you know, ain't just she got like so many titles, so many achievements, like oh, in man. the game. It's like. You know, a producer, songwriter, like arranger, composer. Yes. Um, like you wore so many hats in this game, and 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 made your stamp with a, as an artist as well. That's, that's hats off oh, to you. Amazing, and guess man. what? I saw you on the Mass Singer, and you killed that. <laughs> Thank you. That I was so much fun. Yeah. Thank you. I, it looks like it is. It's a hell of a lot of work, though. 
how 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 many hours did they have you in that thing or or in that like because I know they give you this other shit so that no one else sees who you are, right? Well, when you're on set and you're not masked, you have to have on like a, a like that a big long visor and a hoodie. And, yeah, so you know, nobody sees you. Yeah, yeah gloves, socks. Was it hard to, to to get down in that in the costume? It was difficult. Actually, my first performance. I kind of thought I was like I choked on my sweat because it was very hot. Yeah. Um, and you don't have a mic inside, so you have to really. Protect. Really. Yeah. And um, the sweat was pouring, and I missed like a word in the song, and I started panicking under there, like, "Oh my God, help me!" Like I've never done this on stage, <laughs> never panicked on stage, but I made it through. Yes. I you actually did. made it pretty far. Actually, it was funny because my um, the driver that would pick me up every day at the parking lot was like, "Oh, you're still here?" Like after two or three times. Yeah. And I'm like, what do you mean? I'm trying to stay here. Like, <laughs> it was like, most people don't try to stay. Like, yeah, they're probably... Yeah. It's hard. It's a lot of work. I would imagine. It's a some, lot of work. Because some of those costumes look like they are heavy. And you know? it's hot. And again, you have to... Well, as a singer, a lot of them... I mean, everyone that's a contestant isn't a singer. Yeah. But <laughs> even as a singer, you don't have a microphone in there. So you really yeah, have you to project. project. You're sweating. Out. It's a lot, and then the movement is limited. And you, you you had to try to throw your voice so that they didn't you can only recognize. see right here in front of you. That's like. crazy. Wow. <laughs> and then you're trying to like throw your voice a little bit exactly. so that nobody well, recognizes, right? No, see, that's the thing. I was a little confused because I was like, I already know. I've worked with Robin several times. Yeah. You know, we used to. I used to go to his house to write with him. Yeah. So I was like, if anybody's gonna know, it's he's, gonna be Robin. He's, he's gonna know. But I thought that if they figure, if they even say your name, that means you're out of here. So I right. was like, well, is this a setup? You know what I mean? He's right. gonna know. But I, you know, that wasn't the whole, you know, be all and end all of it. But he definitely knew who I was. You, I can't change my singing voice though. It's yeah. You can try and pick song. <laughs> I tried to pick. That's what happened with my first song as well. I tried to pick a song that was sort of out of my genre. Right. Just to kind of think it's not a typical song people would think I would sing, but that's when I fumbled and yeah. was sweating and choking and all of that stuff. Yeah, I mean, it's it's always when we try to, like, do something that's not like with with that we're used to Listen. doing. You get out of that comfort zone, and it's a little bit... Well, it was already several comfort zones that I was out, out of. Out of yes. <laughs> However, I said after that when I said I'm only singing songs that I know I could go out there right. and kill. Like yeah. I need to know the lyrics. And you Even did. Even the Tina Marie song, I was like, okay, I fumbled a little, but I caught myself on the rap, you know. No, you were killing <laughs> it. I watched. I watched that whole shit. I was like, okay. And ding, then when they ding, unmasked ding. you, I thought I thought you were Cheryl Lee Ralph the whole time. Cause like Sarah Lee Ralph, the yeah, actress. Cause, yeah, cause she, oh, cause, wow. cause she could sing. Yeah, she can. I love her. And My she, daughter is good friends with her daughter. And so. I thought the tone was similar. You know what I'm saying? That's, That's so funny. And, I've never heard that one. And then you popped the mask off, and I was wow. like, "Oh shit!" Every you surprised that everybody. That is not. It, I, first of all, where did you even get that from? Hey, Auntie Shovel, I love her to death. Cause she used like, cause she, cause she I've sung. done her um diva simply singing. Like I said, my daughter and her daughter are good friends, but I just I've never heard that. I ever. just thought the tone. Now you're gonna have me go back and just listen to her voice, her singing voice. I, Cause I thought maybe she was trying to throw her voice a little bit, and I thought that, <laughs> but it was like that tone. You know what I mean? Cause some some go on there and they they try to throw their voice so they don't, you know, get. Cause I you think, think they, so. I, I've heard some change their tones up in there. Maybe. You know what? You know? I think I actually, had I known, because even going into it, I didn't know how much of a real competition it was. Yeah. Like, I had caught parts of the show before, but I wasn't, like, following it to know the real rules. And I'm thinking it's, like, you know, just, like, fun. And, oh, no, it's really a competition. When I got there, I was like, oh, wait, it's really, like, okay, hold on now. You got to get in the bag of songs it's, you know, because I hadn't been even on stage in three years. You know what I mean? Oh, so. no, you, you, you <laughs> fell right in the pocket and started killing that shit. Yeah. It, it was it was cool as fuck. What y'all drinking? What happened? Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> she wanna sip on I know it ain't just ca uh, cappuccino got, and espresso. What you got over there? Be, oh, be, be real's the bartender. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is tequila, and this is some sort of uh, what is it? Whiskey. Whiskey? Mm -mm. Yeah. What else? What's that pretty bottle? This is uh, uh, tequila, but it's like you know, flavored sort of like citrusy type of. Mm -mm. I'll take a what? shot of that one. This one, mm -hmm. okay. Girl. Do I don't it. like like this one. Okay, thing. see that, that now we <laughs> right. See you know like yeah. We'll we'll now now and then, you know, engage in the shot. 
Yep. Wait, pop, you pop. guys are live right now? Yeah, we're live. Yeah. Right Damn, now. what's up, y'all? Hey! <laughs> <laughs> There's no oh. tape right here. This is Not live. All live. Live. It's live. Live. Pass it over. Yo, and it oh just gosh. how it worked out so perfectly because I'm taking myself to Palm Springs for this weekend. Oh. And I was like, wait, I ain't even got to go back to the west side. Yeah. Uh, I'm already, you know, you good yeah. to go. one eighth of the way. <laughs> yeah. Hell yeah. What you going out there for? I'm treating Coachella. myself. Oh, you're Mother's just treating. Coachella is over, boo. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I meant like you going out that way, right? Well, yeah, to Palm Springs, but just a, a cute little house I saw, you know what I'm saying? Okay. That's right. <laughs> Treat yourself. Okay. Treat yourself. Hey, you could stop by my dispensary out on your way over there. You Where know is what I'm saying? It it's, yeah. uh, it's, it's right there in Cathedral I City. I need the intel. It's, it's literally it's, five minutes from Palm Springs. Yeah, it's called Dr. Green Thumbs. Whose voice is that? Yours? That's my voice. Oh, my God. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> That's our yeah. in-house Cali. grumbly voice. How are you voice. doing? In-house in New York. Cali Blaze. Is in our in-house Queen's voice. That's you know? right. <laughs> yes, yes. Cali Blaze? That's me. But I'm Ow. from New York. I'm from Queens, though. But Where now I'm here. Which, <laughs> what you've been smoking on since you've been here in Cali, which you know because there's well. mad flavors up in here. I mean, actually, my very favorite and my current... Okay, I don't want to tell my secrets, but I just came off vacation. I went to Texas and Caicos, and I had to leave a whole ounce of good ass weed over there. I know how I it bought feels. two ounces, but I was not going to bring it back. Yeah, you know what right. I'm saying? Smart. I yeah. gave it to the rental car lady. She was like, Call me next time, you're going to have a car with me. <laughs> 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 but oh, I'll be yeah. smoking the Luigi. That's my, you know, yeah, because I don't really do dispensaries so much because I rather, you know, it's more convenient, leave it in my, you know, yeah. Knock on the door, bing, bing, bong, bong. You yeah, know? Oh, <laughs> real. Leave it on the porch. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you got, you know, you but got. But that's my most, uh, most often that's what I'm smoking, the Luigi OG. Yeah, that is some good shit right there. Yeah. Not for nothing. They they do produce some Shout good out fucking Luigi. flour. Yeah. Hell yeah. Yeah. I got to try it out. You got to try it out, son. That lady is so happy right now, though. I got, I was at this thing called Hall of Flowers that they, that it was in. Uh, Cathedral City in Palm Springs, uh, like a was it two or three day event? What was it? Two days. Two days. Two yeah, days. Two. And over there, I mean, there was mad flavors over there, like Shh. and sh new new shit to get high with. And then you know everyone had their samples of their rosin and and yeah. their whatever concentrate <laughs> they're making the flower. Man, look, I was reverse Santa, right? Santa goes off to drop the bag, right? So the story goes. To drop what's in the bag, right? Shit. When I go, it's my my my, my bag's getting filled up. Filling it up. Yeah, and oh, like yeah. I got so much, you know, flavor Goodies. shit on that run. It was like, you know, good. Salute to all the brands out there because they stepped their game up. A lot of brands had some really good good shit up there at Hall of Flowers. So if you're a stoner, and you know, I'm a fickle stoner. <clears throat> yeah, you I'm should a be. Stoner. You should be. I mean, though. don't get me wrong. I have a homeboy um, up north. He actually has like I, I'll forget his title. I don't want to miscredit him, but he's he's like the first. I feel like I think the first black farm owner. Blah blah blah. Right. Anyway, <laughs> shout out to Cool Coach. But anyway, you know, every time I go up there, I'll go to his store. But I specifically look for what I like. I want the strongest OG. Yeah. So I'm not into like trying different flavors only because I know that. The right. smell and the yeah. taste that I want, and I know, you know what I mean? Faith is one of us. Yeah. So it's like, I don't really mm. be trying a bunch of stuff. Unless somebody be like, yo, you would like this. Somebody that I know, mm. you know, like. Yeah. Yeah, you know what? See, that's the way a lot of us here at this table. And Did you I know, just, just say I'm a fickle stoner? Yeah. You did. <laughs> hey, no, but that's. I got to write a song. That's real shit because. Oh, yeah. I'm a fickle stoner. Yeah. Let me do a verse on Such it. a lonely loner. <laughs> I'll, I'll do a verse on there with you. You know what I'm saying? We'll do it. I'll even sing with you. How about that? <laughs> even oh, though boy. I can't really. Oh, boy. Shut up, Bobo. All right. Yeah. Come on, Bobo. She's a fickle stoner. <laughs> Bobo's already thinking about the percussion. Bobo's playing percussion. Yeah. <laughs> hey, but a lot of us used to think that way. Like, you know, we would smoke o nothing but OG. And if somebody brought anything else to our table, we were like, fuck out of here with that. What are you talking about? No, 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 no. You keep that. We're going to roll this. You smoke with us. But in the last, you know, 10, 
10, 12 years, so many fucking great flavors have popped out that people have crossed with OG that's mm-hmm. kind of strong too, but they got a different, different I've flavor. I've had some decent hybrids. Yeah. I'm not a, a sativa fan. Me neither. Yeah. Same. I don't think hey! any. Hey! Yeah. 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 Hey! Yeah, no, no, you're in the I mean, right circle. You know, I'm just, okay. You're in the right circle. Hey, y'all! Yeah. <laughs> yes. Yeah, yeah. What happened? Yeah, she's in the right <laughs> circle right here. Perfect. <laughs> Bobo, would be, Bobo would be smoking out with us right now, but, you know, he's on Pro Bowl, so he can't, you know, like. You know, criminal activities. Criminal activities. He's the criminal Wait. in now. Trouble Where's Bobo anger. sitting at? Though? He's up top. He's up on top. Oh, okay. He yeah. just met me outside. I don't know how he got up there. Yeah, yeah. He's he's in our isolation area okay. when when one is on probation or airtight something else. He's yes. live from the county. He's live from the county jail. This is his. You know, what I'm saying we got them to spruce his cell up real yeah, quick. I got, I got five months. To Bobo go. looked like the salt and pepper assassin. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. yeah, there you go. I like that. <laughs> Bing bong. You know what I mean? <laughs> Bing bong like a motherfucker. That's right. Yeah, man. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah. <laughs> he's an OG snob, too. When when he's able to smoke, he is Indeed. also an OG snob. We used, That's what we used to call ourselves, OG snobs. Like, because we just be like shitting on everybody's weed. Huh. You man, know, until... I- until someone came with the shit, and we were like, okay, we respect this right here. <coughs> it took a while. I must say I am, I mean, and I used to, you know what? That's all right. God Go knows ahead. my heart. God knows my God knows your my heart. Life. You good. And all my church people. God loves no, us. No, but the funny thing is, like, in parties, typically people know <laughs> I got an ounce or more in yeah. my purse. Of Hell food. yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. they'll be like, yo, I know you got some weed. Like, here you go. <laughs> they can smell it. They're like, hey, that Sorry. perfume you got is like everything. <laughs> Even Hell if yeah. they didn't smell it, they know. They, they like, know. <laughs> they know how you roll. They, you been, you've been a stoner this whole time. I, pretty much. What? And it's funny because I didn't grow up smoking weed. Like, I didn't smoke weed until my first, after my daughter was born, my first child. Like, and I was oh, about really? 20. I wasn't smoking in high school. Like, you know, I was like, I'm not smoking. I had a, my one of my best friends, he was my musician. Shout out to Donovan Jackson in Jersey. Okay. Salute. He might be mad. But he used to play for me, and he was my accompanist. So we would, I would, you know, get paid to sing at places, and he would play for me. But every time in the car, he's smoking. But it was Jersey Babbage, you know what I mean? Yeah. And I smell it, and it was nothing appealing. Like, I wasn't a smoker then. Yeah. And one time I tried it, and I didn't feel nothing. Like, I was like, nah, I can't. Didn't do nothing for Mm-mm. you. That, Came yeah. out here, and Christopher oh, yeah. Williams, my, my, my daughter's father was out here working with Christopher Williams. When I came out here and hit it and just coughed and, he had and knew what shit. it felt like to actually be high, yep. I went back home and they was like, what happened to you? <laughs> and then I married Biggie and yeah. it was a wrap. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Then comes oh, yeah. Hash. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. It was a wrap after that. It, yeah, it, it's, it's crazy when you have an experience like that. You know, like when you, It was on accident on purpose. Yeah, for yeah. sure. Because like when you smoke that real good for the first time, Ooh. you can't go back. What was what was Biggie smoking back then? Dutchies, whatever, we, Phillies. We started out actually. We 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 used to smoke White Owls at White Owls. White Owls. No, that wasn't the the favored thing, but we did smoke White Owls. It was Phillies, Phillies, and then Dutchies. Yeah, all right. And then after Dutchies, I know for me, like the DC Chucky Thompson, rest in peace. They would right. come to New York, and that was when the backwoods came into play. Mm. So that's yeah, back in Vegas. The too. DC people was the first people that that, I, that nice. exposed me to the backwoods thing. It's crazy how it went from Philly blunts to the backwood, to like Dutchess. Yeah, well, to Dutchess. 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 Yeah. Dutchess. Dutchess. but the thinner leaf. Yeah, I think that's what it was. That was the even though leaf. backwoods are thicker, but because a lot of us were fucking with the Phillies for a long time. Yeah, trying I just to find asked him outside, like it ain't a Philly, is it? <laughs> like, yeah, no. yeah. Oh wow! Oh yeah, I don't want no Philly. <laughs> yeah, no, nah, those things. Are, <laughs> yeah, I ain't, I ain't sparked one of them in a long ass time. <clears throat> you remember the Garcia Vegas? The oh, Garcia yeah. Vegas. Yeah, Vegas. Those was nice. And, that was, those good was nice. Soft Swishers. Like it was like a Dutch. They were greener though. Yeah, greener. They were greener. Why do I know all this though? I want. They're wine. Oh, yeah. Fickle stoner. That's Fickle stoner. Fickle stoner, right? Yeah. Were you guys smoking OG back then? Like, that was like. Not at that time in the 90s. No, listen here. Oh, yeah. Oh, you were. Chocolate. Yeah, listen, 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 you were. I want chocolate. Don't front. Let me tell y'all chocolate. something. Y'all, I know y'all heard of Branson. Yeah. 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 Story. 
boom, I'm going to take you back. And I know I've told this story before, but Red Man and, and I, I've known Red Man since I was in ninth grade. His sister wow. is one of my best friends. Yeah. So one time he took me uptown. That's the first time I met Branson. That's way before. And that's like when I was like he's a in. legend. Right. But the, I introduced Big to Branson. But Branson had this week, he called it snow. It was like an ounce jar. That shit was like five fifty, six hundred dollars $600. Bomb ass week. Yeah. You feel me? So yeah. like that was, it was definitely OG. Whatever they sprayed on it made it. If it wasn't, <laughs> child, yeah. it was great. <laughs> it was, yeah, he was one of the But Branson friends. had the OG. Shout out to Branson. Yay! Yeah, you know what? He was one of the few that did have it. And that you know Branson, I mean? like, was that's like my people to this day. I still yeah. keep in touch with him. Yeah. But I met Branson through Red Man, but when I, you know, before I was like super stoner. Yeah. You know what I mean? But when I got in the industry, this when I was still a church girl. Singing. Yeah. I was just riding with Red uptown. You know what I mean? That's a crazy trend. And then was I introduced that, was, Big was, to Branson. Was that the deli store? He has a candy shop. He had a candy shop. Oh, okay. He probably still does. I remember, does. yeah, it was a deli shop. You'd walk in and get your thing. It was candy. Oh, candy. Okay. You look like Christopher Williams. Oh, yeah? He kind of does now that you wow. fucking yeah. say it. Yeah, yeah, that's wow. my brother. Yo, Chris. <laughs> that's my, that's I, my, I didn't want um, like, to blow that's it up. That's my but, brother, for real. Uh, <laughs> that's when I first started smoking weed. If I'm like, not, <laughs> yeah, if I'm not mistaken, I, I, I could have sw- <laughs> smoked out with, with dude he a couple the, times. Shay, yeah, shout he, out to Christopher. And he, Man, yeah, he, he was known for having the bomb bomb, he too. He always yeah. did. No doubt. I totally forgot about that. That's how I knew. I was a stoner. Yeah. <laughs> and at that time, only people like you had access to that kind of weed. Like in New York, like we had the haze when you go to Washington. Oh, and maybe a little yeah, sour yeah. D. Sa- no, maybe definitely. But sour I had, D and I had haze. a couple of, like, you, I don't know. I know you heard of Ricky Powell. He yeah. got pictures. Oh, yeah. yeah. I used to get weed from Ricky. Yeah, rest in I peace. Yeah, honey. DJ Hurricane, that's yes. like my brother. Can I, so Kane. Yeah, yeah salute time, to Kane. That's my bro right there. One time I was right hitting there. Kane like, yo, Branson ain't answering. You got it like, <laughs> and Kane don't even smoke. Yeah. And he introduced me to Ricky Powell, rest yeah. in peace. Can yep. I tell you yes. something that's crazy? <laughs> Ricky Powell was the first person I ever got high-grade weed from ever. Wow. And that was in 94. I used to go to that little apartment with that all was... them damn cats. And he, yeah. 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 he, he stayed there. <laughs> no, no, he did. And he stayed in there. And he stayed, there. He, and oh, yeah. stayed in there he until stayed he passed there forever. away. Yeah, he, he was, was cool as fuck, though. He was the best. And he was that was cool. the first dude that I ever got Fire, fire, whole bud. Yeah, that was my exotic. only other thing other than That's Branson crazy. that I would get in New York. Yeah, he was but a connoisseur. I, you know, I know how to. He was my first. Ricky was drug. a connoisseur. He was. Yes, sir. I typically but, don't go nowhere with yeah. my weed. Yeah, you shouldn't. Yo, you <laughs> shouldn't have Japan, to. You don't. Other than to. Japan, you shouldn't to. have to. Yeah. What I mean, I know that is. You know, I'm gonna get it. <laughs> yeah. Man, when Hera, uh, me and Hera, he would he would sometimes hit the weed a little bit. And he oh, wasn't Kane. Really See, he's telling on you, Kane. No, no, no. He know. <laughs> he know. He know. He no, know. I know. I know. But Kane ain't never smoked with me. Yeah, yeah. He would just take little little hits, little yeah, hits. Because I was always smoking right there. You know. I never, I never seen Kane smoke either. Yeah, he no. never smoked with he, me. He's a he's a drinker more. I, I I you know like that's that's the homie. But I never smoked out with him. You know. And salute to him. You got to check out the show, Jay's yeah. Hat. That he does. Kane was my DJ for several years. Yeah. I mean, yeah. obviously not yeah. during that time, but yeah, yeah. You know, more. Um, I met him through my ex husband, Todd. Yeah. Coach. And, um, I know. Her. Uh, what up, Salt and Pepper Assassin on a <laughs> microphone, <laughs> motherfucking ones and two. <laughs> <laughs> Who the fuck? Yeah. Yeah. That nigga Coach. <laughs> Shout out to Coach. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, when I was with the, when I was with the Beasties, when I was with the Beasties, I me mean, me and her, man, that was my dude. That's that's who kind of like you know took me under his wing when I was with the Beasties mm-hmm. and everything. So uh, yeah, I I know it's all about that. Yeah. yeah, he's cool. He's cool, motherfucker. Yeah, that's that me right there. We got to get him up in here when he comes to Cali. Uh, yeah. You got to. Yeah. yeah, with the last one we did was Skype, right? Yeah. Or you know, Zoom. Yeah, Zoom, Zoom, something like yeah. that. Yeah. But I mean. We, it's still, I'm, you know, I'm still absorbing it that we got Faith Evans up in here, man. man. I'm still absorbing yeah. that I'm up in here. Yeah. Because, yeah. I mean, I know, like, it's blowing, it's blowing people's minds right here that, Ooh. like, you're here with us. Why? And the energy is so rad. I'm right Cause, around the corner. Cause, cause, I'm right around the corner. It, because, I, you know, I don't think motherfuckers understand that, like, you know, you really smoke out like you get down you're like a connoisseur and that what this is about no <laughs> was this a setup no never never <laughs> i thought this was about my charity organization no i'm joking i'm joking i'm joking well no, I'm, joking. Let's talk I'm gonna about talk that. about it but i'm joking 
you know, I, I did know, know I what I, this I, was about. No, no, I know, I know. <laughs> but yeah, let, let's let's talk about that because I mean, you know, that's that's a big deal. Well, um, I do have a foundation. However, um, I have before I even talk about that, I have a son, my um, youngest son, Ryder. He's fifteen. He's on the autism. Where's my camera? It's they the, everywhere. Wait, what happened? Right there. Ow, ow, ow. Boom, boom, and boom. boom. Yeah, boom, okay. right there. Um, my son Ryder, he's 15. He's on the autism spectrum, and um, I sort of curtailed my, you know, my being a performer, all of that stuff, everything. Yeah. You put 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 the career aside for a second because I've had to go through legal issues with the school district. Mm. For the last few years, he's I pulled him out of school, so I've been kind of going through due process and having to re- get reimbursed. You know, yeah. Like I refuse to put him back in a LAUSD. Yeah, for sure. They're mistreating him. You know, and there's a lot of things. And I did some symposiums at the beginning of the um, sh- pandemic. I was yeah. about to say shift just structure. <laughs> 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 at the beginning of the <laughs> pandemic, just free symposiums just to give information because it's shit that I be learning. Yeah. And it's like, if you don't know, you don't know. Like, right. people telling me and even with check, I'm like, oh, they told me I could get paid for this. Well, we just give it to people who ask. Well, bitch, I'm going to know to ask for some <laughs> shit I don't know about. Like, right. you know, so I was trying to just put information out there. So Writers Room Incorporated um, is my foundation I started. We haven't really been on some hey give money type of thing but i have done things to give scholarships to people just on my own however you know the point was to i started it at the very beginning of the pandemic and it was more so at that time with the um symposiums you know yeah we wanted to do like an inaugural inaugural event but the pandemic kind of changed that so yeah but you know it's still there and um this young lady that's been working with my son maliaka she has a uh, um, a club. We're basically trying to start like a boys and girls club for children with special needs. Inclusive, right. you know, yeah. even to include typical children, but you know, places like that don't really exist even for typical kids anymore. Right. Let alone, you know, special needs kids. So I'm trying to help her fund that. So if anybody's out there that's interested in help helping, um, you can look on my Instagram page or you can look on Malia Mitchell and Associates LLC, I think it is. Or a daily autism whisperer, um, but anyway, that's been my platform. You know, yeah. that's what I've been doing. Here we got the links I, right I, here. Occasionally, I dip out of town and go go across town to do things like this yes. with people that I fucks with. But you know, I be at home. <laughs> like, yeah, I only really have three hours a day to myself. So in that time, I'm going through my publishing, auditing niggas, and yeah, you know what I'm saying. That hey, you gotta stay <laughs> up on it. I mean, every day. Every day. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's an ongoing. So, it's, it's an ongoing. You know. Hustle, you know what I'm saying, it's, I mean, and staying on it. It's, what happened? Yeah, but, <laughs> but we love it, you know what I'm saying, as artists. Oh, yeah. You know, but we got to stay on it. C-minus? Yep. Where you from? Here. <laughs> <laughs> right here. I'm from right here. here. I'm from here. Now. Uh, In this studio? Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> you mean Los Angeles? No, I'm from Bakersfield. Oh, uh, that's yeah. So is Coach. Well, no, he's not. His family is from Bakersfield. Yeah. Just FYI, that's to the salt and pepper. <laughs> <laughs> salt Thank you, Fraser. Thank you. <laughs> he said, "I came in with faith." I said, "Oh, you believe now?" Yeah, he said, "Oh, you believe <laughs> now." <laughs> you thought I wasn't going to show up? No, no, it was, it was a Quick joke. dad joke. I ain't tell you to hit nobody else. It was a fucked up joke. I said That's hit me. <laughs> yeah, no, we way. did that. <clears throat> yes. And you know, I'm usually very prompt, but you know, hey, traffic I, was a little crazy. No, the traffic yeah. is I nuts. know how it is, especially with the traffic coming down here. It's crazy. Yeah. I don't know if you remember, but back when your first album came out, you did an interview on Power 106. Mm-hmm. And me and Mr. Chalk were the f- were the first two people to interview you when you came to power, and we were so stoked because we had been playing your single, "Used to Love," uh, "Used to Love Me," and we were really we were oh shit wow like back then Not we would and we Chalk. start you just made me really remember it <laughs> me right? and Mr. Chalk <laughs> <laughs> and I'll always remember like because that's when me and Chalk first started getting into radio and we were just getting like. <laughs> Established, and we had the chance to interview Faith, and it was one of the best interviews we've ever done. I just want—I be to say. talking a lot. It's great. It was <laughs> That's great. always good. It's always a great thing. Oh hell yeah! So I just wanted to. Just and say, I'll be real. 
Ah, ah no, whoa. No, pun. no pun intended. That's right. I swear on everything. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Nah, you're good. <laughs> About to punch this nigga in his neck. <laughs> <laughs> he took the joint to the eye. He could take it. For sure. He's sturdy. Yeah, he <laughs> He's sturdy. Absolutely. If y'all need me to be on y'all show, you know what I'm saying? Oh, I, I, yes. I can come by more. That's a hell yeah. <laughs> come through. Oh, we got we to gotta talk about that. <laughs> yeah, baby. Yeah, yeah, baby. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that ain't no joke right there. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so, so, so how long have you been out in Cali now? I have been living here for about 16 years. Oh, my wow. God. What year, 06 or 05? I moved here, I think, in 04. I was, oh, I'm 06. Wow. I can't no. We close. 05 or 04. My go. son, Ryder. No, I'm th- I've am i been in my house for 15 years. So I've been here for like 16, 17 nice. years. The, su- the, 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 the winters are much better, yeah? <laughs> Every day is a Burn. pleasant day. It yeah. don't even matter. Like, it's year-round pleasant weather. Nobody can say nothing different. Yeah. You know what sucked about New York too? Not just the temperature, the grayness. Like if, mm. even if it didn't rain, it was gray a lot. You're making it, it sound gray. like it's London or something. Nah, but it was. It was gray a lot. Now, yeah, I mean, Europe is I'm, always gray. Yeah, a lot of. Europe, but I grew yeah. up in that, so yeah. like I, you grew You're up there to it, too. Of course, that's what I'm just I saying. I grew up in like when that's I was little. Love. The snow used to be all the way up yeah, here, like drifts. that type of shit. Big that's drifts. why when I came out here, niggas yeah. acting like it's drizzling. They talking about storm watch on the news. Like, <laughs> if y'all don't get the fuck out of here, with this bullshit. It's stop, when it starts. Storm watch, storm watch, bitch. Drive, bitch. Drive. <laughs> no, that's why, man. When it rains out here, people forget but how to drive. Really you know rain- what I mean? Bro, it's it bad. don't really be raining, bro. I, don't. I know. It don't really be raining. Yeah, so it, people it, freak it, out. It's not like it could Jeez, be. Yeah, don't. True. But yeah. you know what I noticed? The drainage. Okay, I'm now I'm gonna be a city planner. Right. The drainage is Let's not. Go. <laughs> Who is that? We gonna campaign for you. The drainage is not right. Why is there so many puddles? Because them fucking little. It's not enough fucking. um, Yeah. Gutter. The drains. They don't. They don't. They don't clear out the drain. So why? Enough. And niggas don't know how to drive over the puddles. Listen, they breaking. The real, second real. it starts drizzling, <laughs> yo, people put their fucking hazard lights on. When Just keep going. And like. slow down. Like, what the down, fuck do you do? Actually, if, hey, if, if you one fucker down, catches the sp- on your brake, so yeah. I'm saying like, don't go fast, but don't break that's real what fast I mean. in the water. Down. Oh yeah, because if you do, you're hydroplane. That's it. Hey, we're known Just for drive through it. We're known for getting that first day of I rain. Mean, it's so many accidents on the freeway. It's like three hundred and something. People freak the this, fuck that's, out. The, that's what I do know about. Out. Yeah. And then at first, maybe now it's changed. You know, I don't know. Shout out to the new weather people. I don't know. Shout out to the new Mother Nature. Yeah. But, <laughs> but <laughs> they be like, oh, it's gonna do this, and it don't do that. And shit. it don't do that. Shit. <laughs> oh man, they, they be lie. they be <laughs> fucking <laughs> up left oh, and right. No. <laughs> no, Shout out to KTLA though. I love KTLA. I'm not talking about them. I'm just saying when I first moved out here. <laughs> now that I've been here for a while, I love KTLA. I used to feel that. <laughs> I wish I could feel that. But they be so wrong most of the time. They be wrong as fuck. Not them, <laughs> but Mother Nature. She be wrong. Right. They be wrong about Mother Nature. <laughs> she be wrong. Yeah. She be telling them the wrong thing. Yeah, she be fucking with them. That is for real. <laughs> I was like, what's it like outside? Not like they said. No. Nope. That was pathetic. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It was. Man. Fuck me, man. Um, let's let's open the doors to the insane asylum because I know you know a lot of fans want you know. See what's up. See what's, say, up. See what's up. Give love and all that. Hey, so uh, let's open it up. Let me put on my lip gloss. Ow. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Open it up. <laughs> Ding dong, bing bong, bing bong, bing bong, bing bong. Welcome to the insane oh, asylum. Shit. All right. Uh, <laughs> Jesus, who that? Let's, <laughs> let's do this. First who one is up. Is that over there? <laughs> Whoa. That's that's, <laughs> that's, that's, that's Bolton Blombo oh, right there. Like where they at? They're up, in, up, there. up in the... Where you at? We're, uh, we're making sure our Bobo's behaving. We're yeah, up here with them. Mad. Thank you, guys. They're keeping silver. <laughs> Keep them in check. They're keeping on, salt pepper in check. I ain't that bad. Don't let me I? have to come up there. SMP, <laughs> SMPA, keeping them in check. <laughs> hey, can you, can I get a... Um, yes, ma'am. Uh, we could do it here. A refill. Well, we got a lot of people. I'll in do the one in- with you, shit. Let's go. You we got should. a lot of people in Why the insane not? asylum asking Faith That's to do a couple flips. 
Hook me up. Flips. I, okay, so no, not not physical flips. <laughs> oh my not, God. Not, <laughs> not gymnastics. Wait. No, we don't got the room for it. <laughs> yeah. That would be something. But they're talking about flips on this thing, right? This is the stunning glass you oh, do like hell concert nah. Chris. Yeah, no. We'll we'll, we'll, we'll do nah. those. I'll do one, but can you I clean it off? She oh, said yeah, one. yeah, yeah, okay. for sure. Yeah. I'll do one. Help her out, Kelly Bless. Yep, I got that. <laughs> well, you know. Callie got it. He's the mechanic. Mike, yeah. shit over. Yeah, so yeah. And now, first of all, is this like an extra shrimp bong, basically? It's, it's a, a bing gra- bong. It's a gravity bong. Explain to It should have been called the bing bong. Right. <laughs> <laughs> the, 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 the bing boing. and the bong right there. So, what it is is pressure, right? So, when what this. What the fuck is this? When this Thank flips. You. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> Yeah, you got to explain to them. Yeah, so <laughs> this is extract. So it's like, okay, look out. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. There you go. It's not crack or nothing like that. Yeah, no way. I know fucking ain't, nigga. Yeah. <laughs> Never that. Never. Not, not over here. I damn sure know it better not be. <laughs> Don't worry. It's all stoner you shit You might have here. me doing some damn flips. I would never. Oh, shit. You ain't got to put what your lips it? on it either. Yeah. You smell it. Oh, it smells so good. Damn right it does. Mm. Yeah, the smoke that's... will push out to you. Can so... you do that sound, boing? You're going to love it. Oh, <laughs> there you go. bang, bang. oh, that smells so good. I Thank need you. That. Thank you. That's what oh, it's like make. a sprinkle, sprinkle, but you can and, do it in there. And the flavor is so going to be. I could sprinkle it. Oh. I got it. Okay. And, and, and the flavor is going to be ridiculous. <laughs> the, the smoke is going to push out towards you. I can use it like <laughs> Keith, but yeah. it's extra shrimp, right? There you go. Yeah. It's actually uh, a, it's uh, a solventless uh, extract, so it, it's the equivalent of hard liquor to beer. Were you yeah. on radio yeah. before you did this? No, nah, that's the first time. Nick, you know should have been. You should have always been. Yeah. yeah, well, yeah. He, I was never comfortable we're, with it. He got me comfortable. We're exposing him to the world. Yeah. yeah. Man, you're doing a great job, Ethan. Well, thank you. I love you for it. So this, is this thing battery operated? We got you. <laughs> yeah. We, yeah, yeah, that's, that, that's, that's it right there. Sure, so look, it's so much going on. on to this. You ain't gotta touch your lips. Just show her, show her what it's like. Like heat it up, so and then it's you'll gonna flip like this, right? No, 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 no. I'm I mean, just, oh yeah, I got you. Yeah, it's gonna. The smoke is gonna come out of here. The smoke is gonna come out of here, and you ain't gotta. It comes out on its own. Yeah, you just breathe. Oh right Lord, it's a lips. fire. <laughs> oh man, what were you saying? What were you saying? Before? I was saying, turn it on. Okay. Mm. Let it flip once, so she could see the how the smoke comes out. Like a vaporizer. Portal. Yeah. <laughs> It'll, it pushes up. Mm, <laughs> portal. Yeah. Let it heat up for a second. Portal. Let it get heated. Hey, do you good. do you heat do mushrooms up. too? Never have I. My homegirl though, she brought me some chocolate bars that has some things in it. Uh huh. But it didn't. You know, I only took a little piece. I don't really. You know. Yes. Yeah. Right. Yeah, that's never a different experience. With psychedelic yeah. drugs. Yeah, we always <laughs> ask folks. I would know, probably be scared. Yeah. I like having my senses. <laughs> <laughs> I got to wake oh, up early. I still got to be on point with my son. Like, <laughs> Yeah, I hear that. I can't afford it. <laughs> so well, it, it's going to it's gotta heat up. It'll and take a sec. Yeah, you'll see. You'll see. Um, th- this is a first right here. We got yeah. a first cracking That's off right. right here. Wait, a first of what? Now, how do I I'll know guess. I want to be that? You do. No, you no, do. no, no, no. The I'm saying it's what? your first time hitting this. It's my first? Or yes. Your you said, first. Oh, okay. We, we do 30. Let's be clear. Oh, we, we, uh, look. <laughs> We do like a lot of. I know things. y'all do, <laughs> but I'm saying like. No, yeah. this is gonna be like oh. one of. Hey. It's gonna be like so it pushes the smoke. Is up. this thing for sale? We we got one <laughs> for you. How about that? Okay, so on this yeah. one, my son would love this. So you okay, just hit this. Jay needs to come on this show. No. So you just hit this one right here. When I'm gonna flip it that way, and now you got to do all of that. Thing. Go ahead. Now it's your Jesus. turn. You know what? You know right, what, hit Boingy? The, hit that! Hit that! Hit that! Hit that! Here, flip, flip it one more time. Yeah, we missed it. There you go, right there. Right this one, right there. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> there we go. That was the one. Oh, wait. All right, flip it one more time. There you go. There you go. Flip. There you go. There I'll be waiting for you in the portal. <laughs> Stop. We can't do that. Dom, you, you break in concentration here. Oh, that's... <coughs> okay. All right, there we go. It. That's, okay. that's good. Okay. Here, we'll take the rest over here. Yes. yes. <laughs> Referee. Mm-hmm. Portal. Portal. Throw the flag in. <laughs> Yes. Yes. Dude, you did flips. You did a great job. <laughs> you did a couple of them. The sound note. Yes. The sound note. You did great. Thanks. Not you did great. Yeah, that <laughs> was one for our first one. <laughs> for you did first great bet. getting high. Yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh my you god. You took a bigger one than Red Man. Huh? You took a bigger one than Red Man. <laughs> no way. Yeah, you yep. did. Yes, you did. 
<laughs> you did? Yeah. You, you kind of did. Yeah. You kind of yeah. did. Yeah. And shout out to Red, man. You know, you did it. But yeah, you, he was just here last did week. a little bit bigger. Red is a stingy, blonde ass nigga. <laughs> <laughs> I know him. Listen, I know him, like I said, since way before I smoked oh, weed. Shit. But like, I'll never forget, like, the first time <laughs> that I actually asked him to do a record with me, like, on my first independent album. And we in the studio together in Venice. And he just was smoking, smoking. And I had weed too. So I'm thinking he gonna pass his blunt. And I was like, yo, let me hear his like, nah, nigga, I got weed, you can roll your own. Like, <laughs> like damn, can I get a boing? <laughs> like, he hit me with a boing. <laughs> I was like, damn, you stingy ass. Like, you're not smoking mine, but you can roll some of my weed and roll your own. Like, oh man, that's And it wasn't even off, no, I don't wanna smoke with you, you type go. of shit. You had a Mike Pence fly on your head. Fucking dirty. We got him out of there. Sorry, yeah, we got on ahead. Get that oh. shit. Yeah, not let you look like. You want a toaster strudel? Thank you. Got you covered. What the fuck is that? Oh <laughs> boy, toaster strudel. That don't sound right. Oh, it's, it's so. Oh, it's good. you know like. It, it, <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> it sounds crazy. That don't sound. It right sounds way. crazy, but it's Hold delicious. On. It's like a pop. Uh, the the rival. You gotta throw it around. Type no, of shit? no, no, no. Hell no. <laughs> it's a toaster. Explain it. It's like a pop tart on steroids. Don't no, laugh. No, 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 no. Don't laugh. No, it's not that. No, no, it's, it's not a pop tart. I might want to toss better. it, but I don't know what it is. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's a toaster strudel. You know what I'm saying? Uh huh. Uh and. <laughs> it's like yeah. a pastry, you know. Uh -huh. You put it in a fucking toaster or, or I yeah, or an oven. In the oven. Mm -hmm. And and it looks like this right here. Look, look, look. It's so good. And then what good. do you do with you it? Eat you eat it. Eat it. No, he said, do you want to toss it? No, no toast. I said a toaster strudel. I didn't know what you <laughs> said. I'm like, what the <laughs> fuck is that? <laughs> toast. He said toss it. Toss it. Toss it. Toss it. I mean, you understand what I heard? I'm like, toss the strudel. That don't sound right. I know I don't want to fucking talk to you. Oh, man, that shit is funny. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> I hear you. Oh, no one would want to cause this brutal. Yo, <laughs> stop playing with me, Salt and Pepper. <laughs> salt and Pepper's here. Salt, salt, salt and Pepper's here. Oh, man. <laughs> Toast that strudel. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. So, wait. You said, do I want a toaster strudel? Yes. yes. I don't eat those. <laughs> okay. All yeah. right. No. All right. I'm, I'm not into pastry. You rather toss I'm not it into then. pastries. No pastries? No. Nah, okay. <laughs> you toss it then. <laughs> no, just stop. Oh, oh. Shit. Yeah, I do. That was everything. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, All right, next. Oh, that shit took yeah. me right there. <laughs> <laughs> He's crying. Look. Send oh, him a box of tissues. He got to clear that shit up. Tears. Not tears. Tears. <laughs> Oh shit! Me and Lil C's was just playing that falling in love for me. Tears. That's what he's. That's what he's going through right now. Another heart knows my pain. If I should be do, could go back. Should we do? See where where was our where was our background work for her, my? I know. Where was I? Heard a little. Come on, Bobo, your low baritone, man. <laughs> yes. Yo, he <laughs> is funny as hell. <laughs> oh yeah, he's funny as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. All right, all right, Bolton, what you got? And we got Job Ra up in here asking Faith, a real legend, and has always been a stoner. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Wait, that's not fair to say. I haven't always been one. That wasn't a question. It was a comment. Right? Yeah, it was. <laughs> I want to take questions. You can't take. They, they're coming. Well, we got one right oh, here. Okay. We got one right here. We got Aka up in here asking Miss Faith Evans, "What's your favorite munchies?" Oh my God, I don't know because here's my thing. Um, geez, this is sad to say, but I'm actually kind of feeling high right now. But yeah. I typically don't really get. Because I guess I'm so much. You know, we can relate here. We, <laughs> yeah. we can totally relate to that. So yeah. it's just kind of like a thing I do. Yeah. And I'm not a munchy person. Like, that's what edibles she, make me do. She is one of them. That's why I don't do edibles, because it's like I'm going to eat and go to sleep. But I got shit to do, so I can't really afford to do She's that. She's fucking right. one of us. Yes, Damn absolutely. Damn it, you need to have me here. You have to be here. All the fucking time. You have to be Stop here. Stop it. No, no bullshit. We're, gonna, we're chopping it up. But, yeah. Yeah. Yes, no. Absolutely. I don't really munch. 
I'm a snacker in terms of when we go out to dinner, I'm ordering 10 things. So I, want, I want to take let a me, bite of all 10. And I know everybody else yeah. is going to finish the rest. Let me ask you this. But I don't really this. even eat. If like, someone were to show up like surprise style, like, because this happens to us sometimes, you know what I mean? <laughs> um, oh, someone yeah. shows up surprise style with a feast. <laughs> Would you partake in the feast? You know, like this never happened to me. Oh, oh! <laughs> oh if you do this show with us, feast. if you do this show with us, <laughs> yeah, it's gonna happen. Why? Would I partake in yes. the feast? Oh, I love good food. Oh, there, but I'm asking we, questions. Yes. I'm, you know, I want to. Oh, yeah. okay, okay, all right. Yeah, I want to know where they. We are come going from. to make this happen. I cannot just eat this thing. We will <laughs> make this <laughs> happen. Have to I would need to see if I see an eyelash or something in there. <laughs> <laughs> I, do not, I do not want. I do, I do not. No. Yeah. But yes, yeah, I am like happen. good food. Yes. I just do not eat a lot. <laughs> Me too. Like Haitian accent. Me no, too. No, that is African. I have oh, been. African. Yeah. There you go. It yeah. might uh, be influenced uh, by uh, all of them. He was trying to find. Most he was of trying my to figure African out. one. Yeah, that's her. That's her inner Miss Cleo. No, <laughs> she's nah, Jamaican. Bro. She's Jamaican. Yeah. 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 Like, call me now. <laughs> call, me <laughs> now. <laughs> call me now. <laughs> that's the Caribbean poppy. What's some of your favorite dishes? African is more peppered like this. Yo, stop laughing. That's good. What were you going to say, Bobo? Uh, <laughs> not, not a damn thing. Not right a damn thing. <laughs> He's crying. He's I, trying I, not I to gonna, cry. I, I was going to ask, I was going to ask, what's, what's one of your favorite dishes that you like to eat? Like Eat or make? Or make, I don't know. Let's eat. say make. Yeah, let's say well, make. I'm a very good cook myself. Mm, yes. Yeah. yeah. I cook very well. I just do not cook very often. <laughs> do people cook- shame cook you like your friends didn't know you could cook? It's no, a- my friends would <laughs> like for me to cook more often. Okay, yeah, my, mine too. They but shame I cook cooking. very well. I like um, pasta dishes. I cook a lot of seafood. And... Beef, anything, right? Well, pork, I made some good ass short ribs. Pork. I'm about to make oh. some this weekend. This pork. fucking guy right here. Yeah. He I can whip it up. I cook yeah. pretty well, but my mom has been in like food service for all my life. Dope. You know? Oh, so oh, yeah. no vegan. So the clean cook. Not clean as in vegan, but clean as in gloves and, yeah, you know, I've nice. been off that way before. The, yeah. You know. I mean. And them, uh, yeah. babe, way before the uh, panoramic. <laughs> That's the knowledge. That's yeah. knowledge, B. My friend said, you know it was a panoramic. Yeah. <laughs> like, what? <laughs> <laughs> well, what? <laughs> Jim Jones. Shout out the big girl. Uh, what's yeah. the favorite dish for you to cook? Like, what is, what's one of your favorites that you like? Oh, I'm gonna well, make. I'll tell you one of my kids. My my son, CJ, and Josh. Shout out to my kids, China, CJ, Josh, Ryder. But they was hitting me, and I wasn't going to cook on Thanksgiving or Christmas. I was like, I ain't planning on cooking. He was like, well, I was just wondering if you could make, can y'all get a ding, ding? Ding, ding. Got one. There you go. He was like, some scalloped potatoes, some lobster mac and cheese, Ooh. some stuff this. Some, it was like five dishes that it's like, damn, I guess I'm cooking now. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't going to cook nothing. Like, yeah, I like those requests. I'm famous for my scalloped potatoes, which I got that recipe from Red Man's mother when mm. I was in high Ooh. school. Oh, shit. I'm Word. famous for my um, seafood stuffing. Like, I make a seafood stuffing with crab, lobster, and shrimp. Oh, shit. Um, they be pressuring you to cook. I make a huh. good stuffed salmon, a good barbecue salmon. Um, All right, she's going to have to bring rib. some of that shit down over here. I make God good lasagna it. stuff. Ooh. Oh, yeah. oh no. Do now, yeah. can you know, we make... You Listen, know, you y'all know. got a stove in here. I though. dare do you. That. No, can we do that? <laughs> we I can even bring it pre-cooked, pre-something. And we yeah. Can, Y'all could stuff the shells. Yeah. You talking about fucking toast tossing a <laughs> You talking about <laughs> toss, toss, toss tossing a, a croissant. <laughs> <laughs> toss the stuff strudel. a shell, nigga. You want to toss a strudel. <laughs> toss that strudel. You can, you can cook all that. Let's and stuff then, a shell. And then B Real can make his, his spaghetti. B Real makes a good spaghetti. You know that? <laughs> yes, he does. Here yeah. we go with spaghetti. You think that's not like a I make great spaghetti. <laughs> Chef, I just made some great crab spaghetti. <laughs> Chef Ooh, boy, last R-B. Wow. Chef Boy R. Beef. Crab spaghetti. Mm-hmm. Mm, that shit sounds <laughs> What about great. chicken? How about you're... lobster? You ever had the lobster spaghetti? I make all. I put I lobster, crab, and shrimp in most of my uh, seafood dishes. Don't do that to mm. me. But either. this last don't weekend, I was where? <laughs> I was in Turks and Caicos. So yeah. all they had in the, in the place that I wanted seafood. was the crab. Uh. The shrimp I didn't like, but the crab I took. Yeah. What that's why like about the shrimp? It was supposed to be seafood spaghetti. Yeah. But it was crab spaghetti. Sorry, guys. Why was yeah. the shrimp bad? Yeah. Well, it wasn't fishy. bad, but don't, it was already don't, don't frozen. Bring oh. Don't bring me that plate. Don't You know what I mean? Right so I just texture. wanted to take the crab. Yeah, yeah. Right. Work. No, it work. probably would have tasted 
good. Yeah. It probably was. It's not fresh. But we still had to throw it out. Yeah. Word. Even though it was what I made was great and fresh. Mm. I think, hey, hey, all my friends that met me in Turks and Caicos. Bing, bing. <laughs> Big bang. <laughs> Bolton. <laughs> Dude. Bolton. <laughs> and next up in here, we got King Sun 122 asking Faith, how did the Love Like This remix happen with Fat Man Scoop? Was it planned or oh, was it shit. just a blend? That's a funny story. That's funny. I was just telling someone about that. And shout out to Scoop. Word. But shout out in real talk, Fat Man Scoop. IRL, I heard this song and I'm thinking, like, damn, this must be a remix Puffin them put out. I don't know about which could, wasn't likely to me, you know? Yeah. Mm hmm. And the nigga put it out, and I ain't have no nothing on it. It's my song. So yeah. I had my lawyer bing bong. I had my lawyer go bing bong. So, yeah, it was a whole nother <laughs> record. It wasn't yeah. a remix. It ain't like <laughs> laugh again. <laughs> it's that man Scoop, right? Sure. Yes, but I love Scoop. But I'm like, I want to attribute it to just, I'm going to just say, you know, it was a hind thought that they thought it was a remix that they were just doing as a DJ. That's what I'll say. Yeah. But it was registered with a different title. And my publishing, <laughs> we ain't negotiate nothing. Mm, you feel right, me? Right, right. Yeah. I don't even know if I was on that shit at first. Yeah. But nonetheless, I worked that out for myself. Bing bong. Right. <laughs> Bing and bong. shout out to Fat Man Scoop because it actually made that song way bigger. Oh, hell yeah. Mm -hmm. Like at the time, my husband at the time went to um, San Tropez with Puff and he was like, we was in the club and they was like, I love them. Who are they? Like they thought we were a group. I like, you know I like what that I mean? remix y'all yeah, had. The, but the re that's the what remix. we talking the about, remix. boo. Yeah, Catch I'll up, mustard. Come on. Oh, <laughs> shit. That's what we was talking about. Oh, <laughs> That's what we talked about. It because, wasn't so, a remix. So, they, so, so that was the original? It was not. It was, no. It was, it was a remix. It had nothing to do with so me. What the, it was a separate song. song. He, was the, said, he she, put it out as a separate song. But I think, I think, because I know he's a good guy and I love him. I think he probably did it as a DJ, as a remix, you know, radio. Yeah, labeled right? it. But it actually charted. And I wasn't credited. You know what I mean? It was okay. just, I had to, but I'm on top of all my shit. So I had to go back. Like, wait a minute. <laughs> like, hello, bro. <laughs> I'm not getting on, on my record. Even though it's dope. You know what I mean? Yeah. Nah, but but I, I thought at first it was a remix. That's what I'm saying. But I'm like, well, but it was his known. his own his separate own record. thing, right? Right. Yeah, it was. Confusing. But it made the shit. That's what I was. You know, it definitely gave the song another life. Yeah. Yo, bing it. bong to Fat Man School. Yep, it gets played to this day. Yeah. More legs to this day. All right. Pulse. Like a wrestler, yeah. another what? notch under my belt. <laughs> Shout out to Lil Kim. <laughs> we about to do a Biggie dinner, as a as a matter of fact. Kim Kim is um. Uh, that's Put right. There's a, a, it's a, a 25 biggie. year anniversary right now. Oh, right? Big will be or, 50 May 21st. Oh, 50. It's 50 wow. year. Oh, it's um, birthday. Birthday. Wow. wow. So we gonna yeah. be in New York at the um, Empire State Building. They gonna light it up. But it's an anniversary for one of the albums. No, right now, right? that passed. That, oh, that, that was, passed. That passed already. Right. But yeah, it may be. Yeah. But I know, you know, his birthday is May 21st. He would have been 50. Mm. Mm -hmm. That's right. Wow. And we got Midget Mike up in here saying shout out to the Queen in the house, Faith. Hey! And we got Todd Watson up in here saying, Happy Friday, fam. Much love and respect to Faith Evans. Can we get a moment of ohms with Faith? Party one, two, What's three. What's that? Okay, so. You got to explain this. Y'all got know, a bunch you know, of shit going on up in here. I know. <laughs> tossing the fucking, tossing the bun. Yeah, to <laughs> toss it. Toss it. Toss that strudel. <laughs> toss toss that strudel. There we go. Uh, you, know, go you know the whole thing with meditation, yeah? You said what? Meditation. Uh -huh. yeah. <laughs> I pray. I pray all Say day, what? every day. So, so yeah. So meditation. They do What's ohms. The oh, to, ohm. A O H M. Yes. Ohm. So we're gonna do four of them right now. Oh, okay. All right. <laughs> all right. They try to calm us down. Are y'all doing yes. they, they're, they're, like Y'all do the hands and stuff? If you like. You, you ain't doing you it, like, though. Man. You got I, the joint. I got the joint. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, so hey. how, now we're right. going to right. do who's the counter? So this is how we trigger it. This is how we trigger it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm a same with you. You know what I'm saying? All right. C minus. Yes. <laughs> Chill out, man. <laughs> oh. 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 Who's playing that? Oh. 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 Come on. Oh. 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 Can I say something? Yeah. I do this with my son Ryder. It's we just breathe though. Yeah. I'll be like, take deep breaths. Yeah. 
you know, count to 10 and try it again. We'd be like, one, yep. two, you know, because he has anxiety and stuff, you know. And the but breath yeah. brings it, it, you to center. Who, who said that? Tell me his name again. Who tossed the salad again? No, I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> What's his name? Who won the home? Yeah. <laughs> That's salt and pepper. <laughs> yeah. Hey, oh, so no, I'm good. saying, what's the guy who wanted the home? Oh, yeah, who's the guy oh, that wanted oh. the homes? Um... Bolton. Oh, the guy that wanted the ohms, that was Todd Watson. Hey, Todd. Thank you for the ohms. And breathing is, by the way, the best thing for anxiety. For a lot of things. It does. People don't realize like how much it can control. Like, well, I you do control that your the breathing. Time. Yeah, it's amazing what to it can do for you. I don't need nobody to know about it. Yeah, when you're like, you know what? Yeah, yeah, when you well, stress the fuck out. real. Up, but. <laughs> when you stress the fuck out, so real. meditate, goddammit. So real. God knows I'm not. <laughs> yeah. I'm we, just going past that bun. <laughs> Both. And we got Megan up in here saying, love your vo faith, I love your voice and strength. I am also an advocate. Bless you for spreading awareness and bless you for your music. Oh, wow. Thank you. Oh, yeah. And please, if I don't know, you know, this may be somebody that is already aware or you know navigating it but you know if you don't you can look back at my um free symposiums on facebook on writersroom.com i think it's called uh, but you can look it up faith evans <laughs> symposiums for autism i'm sorry i don't remember the exact um facebook name but you know what? Stop, it. stop shooting me, nigga. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> Drop the bombs. I'm trying to talk. <laughs> anyway, no, really, thank you for that. Um, but it's just so much with navigating it. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's a lot. And it, it's so many things that if you don't know, you don't know. Like, if I had a nine-to-five job, yeah, I would not be able to pop up at my son's school and see somebody mistreating him. Yeah. You know, yeah. I wouldn't even if I didn't have this lady that's been working with us, I wouldn't know that I don't have to sign this paper and I could question things and get get them to pay me back for the things I have. to. You know? Yeah. So it's just a lot to it. Hey, it's good that you're educating people on that because they that's wouldn't know. That's what I do want to do. Because they would I not actually, know. I want to talk to you about something because I really want to try and do a music festival thing around that. Yeah. Did I say festival? <laughs> no, you said no. You said festival. You did it. You I said festival. Right? Yeah, yeah. I said festival. I was like, I felt like that's the ball. Damn, that's the portal. That's that damn. Yeah, that's that flip. That's the ball. Yeah. Yo, Christopher Williams yeah. over there. The Yo, Chris. <laughs> AKA mustard. Yeah. Yo, mustard. Don't worry, hey, mustard. Me. Oh, don't, don't. I'm dreaming. I got the mustard. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, he got the mustard, the ketchup, and the pickles. <laughs> wow. I hope he don't got the onions. Word. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> what is that? Do that sound again. <laughs> oh shit. You know what? It is. I can't stand him. All right. <laughs> and we got pots up in here saying, always love faith. Faith's personality, much love, and stay blessed. That's right. And you too. God bless you too. Thank you. I'm always the same. Look, I ran out. Okay. I wasn't, I'm not trying to burn in Turks and Caicos, but <laughs> when it just so happens when I was just on vacation with my son and my daughter, um, one of my best friends from elementary school met us down there. And then we were on this tiki boat in the middle of the ocean. And then I got a text from one of my friends that's a doctor that I went to school with. They're very popular, called The Three Doctors. And he was like, someone told me that Faith Evans was here. And I was like, no way. And I was like, oh, such and such is here. And we went on the thing. And he was like, oh, my God, I saw all your, um, you know, he was like, I saw all your uh, shit, symposium. Yeah. Sorry. I would, I've been tossing the bun, y'all. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway. Smoking you know, that forgetful was... <laughs> OG. That forgetful OG. That's yeah. what we've been smoking. You know right what? There. I'm shutting up. Never mind. <laughs> what was, you was talking about it, next, it was anyway? A, it was a symposium. No, it's okay. It's okay. Go on to your next subject. <laughs> I'm not fucking with We high as hell right now. We I'm know. Not fucking oh, with <laughs> All right. <laughs> 
And y'all can catch me here anytime they want to have me back. You know what I'm Hell saying? Hell yeah. Oh, we going to talk w about that. motherfucking <laughs> fizzy from the Bricks Radio. You know what I'm saying? Dot <laughs> 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 com. Oh, yeah. Well, I was going to say, speaking of that, we got Miss Angelique saying, yes, please come back. Faith with her own queen See, chair y'all see the what studio. they talking about, yo. Yep. We need yo, a queen. come on, chat, 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 chat. Snap it up, y'all. <laughs> Give it up. Give it up queen. on the live. Give it up on the live. That's right, yeah. Y'all know what it is. That's yeah. right. Yeah. Come on, chat. Give me Toss a fart it. noise one time. Toss that strudel. <laughs> <laughs> Toss it. Toss that strudel. <laughs> Toss that strudel, <laughs> God damn it. Oh, Toss shit. the strudel. Oh, my God. That's, ain't that some shit? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, my all God. Way. All the way. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Now nah, he's going to give all of them. Bing dong, ying, yang, ying. Ding, ying, ying, bong, bong. Ding, dong. Oh, shit. You that's know what? That's one. Wait, okay. Yeah, that's I ain't going to tell that story. All right. <laughs> that's, oh, that's, that's after y'all oh, hire me. Better. I'll tell that story when y'all put me on the set. All right. All right. <laughs> I got a story. We, we want to hear that story. Oh, we we want to hear that story. I have a couple of them, actually. Oh, we need them. <laughs> A couple well, of blowout crazy. stories. <laughs> Blow it out. Blow it up. Blow. Some blowouts. Some blowouts. Uh, Blow. Uh, <laughs> oh, the oh man. Good. <laughs> yeah. Um, uh, portal. Um, <laughs> portal. Yo, who is the girls laughing? I like. That's let me hear the Rara. girls again. Let me hear the girls. <laughs> let me hear the girls. <laughs> no girls. That's Rara. That's Rara. Know, but let me hear the girls. <laughs> These two. Oh shit, that's real people. <laughs> yeah. Oh shit, I'm sorry. No offense. No offense, records. <laughs> no offense.com. That would be a good label. Yo. No offense, records. Listen. And then, <laughs> and then put Yo, the most. Why he sitting there so? <laughs> <laughs> That's less man. I'm high as That's fuck. Mustard. I'm drinking. That's I'm, mustard. I'm <laughs> That's how mustard rolls. Psycho uh, mustard. She said I want to hear the girls again. <laughs> Yo, stop. Uh, okay. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm sorry, y'all. Uh, uh. Uh. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. I'm just enjoying myself. <laughs> Me too. Me too. Y'all motherfuckers. Me too. Ooh, okay, I'm, shit. I'm just, uh, <laughs> really. You got that off, right? Uh, yeah, you got yeah. That. Shout out to my faithfuls, because I didn't even, you didn't tell me to post nothing, <laughs> but I know they know I'm they, going here, <laughs> and they fucks with me. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, Shout out. They be you. like, yo, bitch, we love you. You so fucking real. Yeah. Yo, oh, ass, yeah. Oh, they yo ass, ass you right. crazy. Everyone but listen, I'm really not crazy. I'm sweet. I'm so nice. You know what I'm saying? I'm I'm cool as fuck. We know. I'm just oh, yeah. we right I'm here with you. I just right be real. With you. I just be real. <laughs> yeah, real. Hell yeah. Real and cool I like just Jay. be real. Hell yeah. The chat's loving you. Everyone in oh, the Twitch chat is loving you. Oh well, yeah. I'm not saying everybody has to. Yo. You know, if they don't, that's on you. It's all good. Yeah, we right. can't let please them know. That's your problem, not mine. Hey, let them that's know. Right. That's I'm right. I'm just saying. That's right. We can't. I don't care about that. I'm just saying. Yeah. My faithfuls love me. That's right. That's right. And I know they on there because I didn't get a date. Probably going to hit me like, why you ain't tell me you was going to be on there? <laughs> you didn't send me like, oh, can you post nothing? Mm, but your yeah. shit is so big. You know what I'm saying? He don't need all that. He tossing the croissants and shit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> tossing the strudels. <laughs> you know what I mean? Tossing the strudels. They popping up like toast. You know what I mean? <laughs> like, <laughs> 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 yeah. Oh, what the okay, fuck yeah. was that? Oh, no. Who the fuck did that? Nah, we getting, oh, we getting deep now. Oh, Yo, man. Dude. Damn. Yo, man. Damn. Damn. Cross the fucking line with that. <laughs> <laughs> it was fucked up. Man. Oh, <laughs> By damn, far. Man. Tell him how you really feel, Blaze. You got faith spitting oh, shit God. up over him, man. Oh, my Great. God. Was <laughs> Lewis, I'm on the <laughs> Friday, high day. God it's, damn. It's, it's a strong. His fault. It's his fault. It's a strong. <laughs> Oh, my fault. <laughs> oh, Lord. And we got J Max C up in here saying much much love to everybody. Faith Evans, you were a riot on Drink Champs, and I oh love my to God. see you on here. Much love from Drink Toronto. Champs. How yeah. you? No, I was the same girl, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> they was just tossing more croissants. <laughs> wow. And they had oh, that yeah. uh, that tiger bone, you know and, and what I mean? Did you, did you try that Mama Wana that they got over there? 
I smoked everything. I drank. No, no, no. no, no it's a drink. I smoked everything. Oh, shit. Well, not everything. I mean all the weed. Let's yeah. be clear. Yeah. Not everything. Let's be clear. No, yeah. it's cool. I meant all the weed. It, it, it's the drink that EFN drinks. <laughs> it's a Dominican drink. Thank you. Yeah, it's a Dominican drink. Is it's, it milky? Yeah. No, no, no. It was like reddish. Um, right? I don't know. Like, I drank the Tiger it's Bone. Like, uh, it's like but reddish. But I had Tiger Bone with Branson, so that's why I drank it like that on here. They, yeah, they be having some drinks over there. Yeah, I didn't drink a bunch of drinks. I drink my Tito's. What's that you know? tiger bomb? No, I didn't do that. But, but they say that's good for that tiger bomb. Yeah, the bomb. mama. I don't know, but that shit get you yeah. real. It's like true serum. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. I believe it. Yeah. They be having some real shit over there. So no, count. Branson is the first time I had that was at Branson's uh, spot with Lil C's and like half a junior mom. Yo, shout out Lil C's. Word. I just did C's podcast too. He about to be out here with me. You should. We have gotta him get. On we gotta get him over here. Got him over here. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Little bro. And we yeah. about to be on Love and Hip Hop Miami. Oh, that's what's up. Oh shit! I'm sorry. Uh oh. Mm. oh man. We didn't hear that. I don't know if that's true. <laughs> we didn't hear that. <laughs> Maybe not. <laughs> wow. <laughs> sorry, sorry, we sorry, sorry. Stop, we, stop lying to the people. <laughs> it may be true or not true. You do know what? <laughs> All right, next time. It's a throw in the towel on that. And we got, bo- we got Boxer Cali in here. Like Boxer Cali. Oh, that's saying. a good angle right there. Oh, you ain't cute. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead, Bo. And we got Boxer Cali up in here. Boxer Cali saying we need to start having Faith Fridays. Yeah. Oh, hey. yeah. Call it Fizzy Fridays. Fizzy Fridays. Fizzy Fridays. Hey. Fizzy okay. Fridays. Fizzy Fridays. That's it. That's it. Hey, really. Don't boing me, nigga. I mean, stop boinging. <laughs> Why are you boing it? You boing it too much. I'm boing sorry, it, no boing. offense. I'm a black woman as well as a whatever my father is woman, but <laughs> oh, yeah. let him know. Stop boinging me. <laughs> Not African. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> yo, y'all is high and funny as fuck, yo. Hey, we do. We I do. am as well. Yeah. Yeah. I'm a stoner and a loner. Yeah. You ain't alone here. <laughs> We right here. here with you. Wait, girl. I forgot my song. I'm a select. What I say? Uh, uh, a, I fickle said a, a fickle stoner. A fickle stoner. stoner. Fickle <laughs> stoner. Yes. I have memory like elephant. I see this thing. You have said the same thing. <laughs> I have said a long time ago. <laughs> <laughs> you have remember. <laughs> and I remember. remember. <laughs> All right. And we got Montreal up in Yo, here. Yo, okay, let's back it up, though. Who said that? <laughs> let's go back. Shout out to who said Fizzy Fridays, yo. You did. You did. No. An, oh. Stop it. Somebody <laughs> Oh, the, no, bro. Oh, that oh, was oh, I, right That's there. my name, though. That's yeah. my nickname, Fizzy. They said they Faith go. Friday. Okay. But they call, yeah. Who was it, Bolton? That was Boxer Big Cali. Fizzy from the Bricks. That's my name, go. Big Fizzy from the go. motherfucking Bricks. Word. It was Boxer Cali. So, Fizzy Fridays. That's As right. it should be. I used to put out little songs that I ain't never put out on Friday and say, Fizzy Friday. All right. It's Great snaps you know, all It's all good. If they don't, it's all good. Oh, I'm glad. Going, I'm going. glad somebody thinks <laughs> oh, we going to. Shit. that I should be here. A lot yeah. of people think that. Oh, oh. yes. We agree. <laughs> Absolutely. One million percent. Yo, stop. Yo, you, you are too much. <laughs> no. You need to settle down, Mustard. Hey. I'm not too much. I'm so quiet most of the time. I don't ever get to be this. It's live. True that. It's live. I be at home. <laughs> hey, man. I be here and at home. I got out my cage. No. <laughs> It's good to have you on the show. You know? Hell yeah. Please, please come back. So you got, yeah, no, we're going to work it out. Like the Beatles. Every no, first Friday. <laughs> Every third Jeez. Thursday at the Do Drop In. Hey, we can work it out. Every 
Fizz Friday. Every Fizz Friday. Nah, we gonna we gonna Fizzy uh, fucking Friday. No, I would love to come back. However, no, you having fun. Whether it's Friday, oh, yeah. you know, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Oh, we'll make it fucking day. happen. Yeah. And Fridays, you know, we do the Friday Jam after this. Oh yeah. I don't we, know anything. All I know is I'm going this. to Palm Springs after. This. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, vacation. Word. Oh, and for all you motherfuckers call me Red, it's because I was in Palm Springs and that. Burning ass fucking heat oh, yesterday. Yo, you got to get you gotta tan. Reason. You got to tan. No, this shit is burning, down. man. You got to get shea butter and coconut oil. Yeah, that's Stop. for that's now. I put that. some block on Act my like bald ass head. Act like a black person when yeah. you go in the sun. Oh, I do, but with, with how I'm I take both. care of it. But I'm both. Yeah. yeah I'm telling you. Yeah, We're yeah. the same complexion. Yeah, well, it's the Puerto Rican blood. I just got a tint from... Um, Turks, but yeah, the yeah, same color. exactly. That's my. You gotta sloth yourself. That shit, yo. <laughs> let me tell you something. Hundred and four degree weather. I don't give a fuck what it is. You're gonna burn no, you your gotta, goddamn but skin. you're gonna heal. You're gonna yeah. tan. But that shit is still burning. You're gonna heal and peel. Mm -hmm. Heal and no, peel. No, you will not peal with my mixture. I have I, good well, with my mixture. I, do this. I have a great <laughs> mixture for the sun. She what does <laughs> these. <laughs> I do. That's a yeah. I have this. <laughs> she does this. These work for you. She works. I will tell you about this thing. <laughs> <laughs> Bolton. And we got Montreal up in here saying, ask Faith. Montreal? Montreal, that's one of my faithfuls. I told y'all my faithfuls fuck with me. Stop right. playing with me. Give him a... Give him one. Oh, you want to... There you go. Thank you. Thank you. That was Montreal. Quick, that's my faithful Montreal right there. All right. What he said, what he's he asking, said, uh, he got my number what? He's asking, <laughs> when can we get some new music? Montreal, you asked me that via text already, boo. <laughs> I don't really be in the <laughs> I don't really be in the I mean, I have three hours a day to myself. My son is not in the regular school program. I mean, you know, that's not, I have several songs in my cachet. Oh, are they getting ready? You get you gonna put mean, any of them out? No, it doesn't mean that I'm not really. I have. You I just don't work? have time to prep it. Yeah, I don't even have time to work. I'm saying songs that I've started and not finished. Oh. ideas that I. But my schedule with my son doesn't allow for me to commit to something else right, right now. Right. You know what I mean? That's right. Imagine that's right. only having three hours. Yeah, that's crazy. A day to do everything you got to do. Yeah, for no. you. Yeah, no, that's right. You ain't got an. And then every as, other weekend he's with his dad. Shout out to Ty, coach. Coach. You coach a brr, and CJ and um Josh. You feel like but there ain't enough a, hours in the day. It, but three hours to do yeah. all the things that are outside of your child. Yeah. yeah that's not crazy. much at all. So I yeah. could never commit to nothing. Yeah. That's one thing I'll never lie to nobody. I'd be like, I don't think I could do that. <laughs> yeah. uh, I, that ain't gonna. Be you got to know the limitations, <laughs> right? Uh, Shit. I would never tell you I'm going to do some shit that I can't. Yeah. Because typically I can't. <laughs> <laughs> That's real shit. Oh, yeah. the real it's fun. about writer. Like. Hey. And we got Steven in here saying, Faith beat Redman as best guest. <laughs> Wait. Wow. Oh, Wait, yeah, yeah. Hey. Oh, shit. Yeah. Hold on. Let me FaceTime Red. <laughs> While we're on here, let me FaceTime Red. <laughs> let me FaceTime Red. Let me FaceTime oh, Red. Oh, Oh man! Let me face wow! Tom Red. You know he he ain't wrong. <laughs> Let me face Tom Red. That's, that one was Yo. hard to top. Wow! Hey hey hey! Watch! <laughs> Don't toss no buns. <laughs> no, no bun toss. No bun tossing. Entertainment.com. No bun tossing records. <laughs> yeah yeah yeah. Mm. Uh, you know what? I'm, you know, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yo, hey, yo, Reggie, yo, look, bro, look. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yo, they said I just beat you as the best guest, nigga. <laughs> 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 He said, what you mean? <laughs> what you mean? That's what the fan said. <laughs> Yo. Wait, what? What happened? I said, I'm glad you come down there. That's what we do. No, but I beat you as the best guest. <laughs> What you do? Get on the table and, and get a lap dance for somebody? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that don't even sound like me, bro. Why would you ask me that? I'm offended. <laughs> I tossed the croissant. I tossed they croissants, nigga. She tossed the screwball. She tossed the screwball. Wow. 
<laughs> oh man. Yo, you wow. stupid. <laughs> Oh man, man she I beat you. I beat you. I motherfucking beat you. Wow. She looking shit. Why you look like down. you in the mall though? <laughs> Yo, hold on. Talk to me real, please, please. Man, y'all yeah, damn. Yo. Damn. <laughs> I don't know what happened, yo. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! And you know that you, a, no, a, a fan. That don't make no fan, fucking sense for a, him to a ever. A fan say called that. in. I'm very offended. He would ever ask that question. A fan nigga. called in right here. Like, never have I left this, dance this for right anybody here. in my life, and I've been and married said, three times. And they said she. Well, beat maybe you. one or two of them. Maybe all three, but it's only them. Like, it's not like a, no public lap dances. I, I, you know, I didn't. The fuck. You know, hey, look, I, I didn't know you. Stop. They was even running y'all like my that. Him that right there. <laughs> Bing bong. Talk to Red. Talk to Red. Oh. All right. Love you, Red. <laughs> <laughs> what? I said, y'all enjoy. Have fun. You too. Yeah. <laughs> you too. Your face is so close. I love you. <laughs> wow. Oh, man. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> oh man. Oh, shit. I mean, how can anyone argue that right there? You know? Man. That was a classic moment. Oh shit. Of, oh. of yeah, of the history of this shit, right? Yeah, she immediately said I'm FaceTiming him right now. You guys ever did any joints, Redman? Oh yeah. Faith? Um mm-hmm. well, my first song that I did recorded with him was on one of my first um independent albums. Oh. And then he did another one, and then I just did a song for him. I did actually a couple of songs for him since he's been independent. Right. But we have one that's coming out in the summer. Oh, that's Me, him, be, and Rock Wilder. Oh, that's going to be a <laughs> banger explosion. Oh, I can't wait to hear that shit. Right. No, but Red is family. Like, you yeah. know, Hell that's yeah. my daughter's godfather, you know. Y'all go way the fuck back. Like When that. he was a drummer in church. A drummer? I Look. I, you I'm from not, the Bricks, too? Yeah, she's from yeah, the Bricks, yeah. Nigga. Bricks? What happened? That's what that is. Brick town. Uh, uh, come on. Jersey girl. That explains. Come yep. on. Big busy from the motherfucking Bricks. Uh, yeah, I'm from Jersey. Okay. So, actually, in ninth grade, Red was my so-called boyfriend, even though that, I, you know. So he was the first, like, dude that my grandparents let come to my house. Mm. But his sister was and still is one of my best friends. So that's how we met. But he was a drummer in his mother's church. And that's why they trusted, like they, you know, yeah. he was, at that time he was a, you know, and that was right before Eric, you know, kind of, he started yeah. DJing and Eric got a hold of him and all that. Yeah. You know. Mm. One of the baddest rappers on the planet right there. But right that's up. my family. You, yeah. you know what I mean? It's not it's like dope. that. Like, that's my family. That's my daughter's godfather. He actually helped me get away when I had no money before I had a record deal and I was out here pregnant. And one of the illest producers. I stole my baby daddy car and drove to San Diego and got like $300 from him to get back to Newark. Like, <laughs> For real. And I got real. shot in the arm in Long Beach at a fucking gas station. Nigga. Oh, shit. For real. It's all in my book. You can get it called Keep the Faith. It's out now. That, that's it's been out one. since 2018. Hell yeah. That's it's right. real story, real facts. And she's an author. I was on my way driving to see Red to get like three, four $400 to get back home before I had a record deal. Mm. On everything. And see, and she's an author. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And I'm a gangster nigga. The, what? Yeah. And you gangster. Can, and you Let them know really Gangster. Yep. Gangster. <laughs> Shout out to DJ Quick and his mother. <laughs> yeah. Heard up. Trill. Oh, and, uh, just say, <laughs> Who said that? Salt and pepper? Yeah. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> well, you know. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Just letting everyone know the funkies are actually dropping but right now. Anything. Yeah, I'm drinking. Hold oh, on, you know on. what? I was Can supposed we? to gotta get a drinking. shot myself. Okay, I, I didn't that. mean to overlook their comment, though. See? Yeah. I'm sorry. I don't want to take a... <laughs> <laughs> Let me grab mine over here. You know. What? When he was being up to you? All right, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> Bolton. Oh, I was just letting everyone know the Funkies are dropping right now. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Right now yeah, they are. Dropping. So, OJ, What's that? OJ flavors. See these? Those, what you smoking? The, yeah. the pink. Look like orange juice. Glass tip. Yeah, the glass tips. Did we smoking on the joints? Funky right? oh. orange. 
We that looked like Just fucking fire. penne pasta, nigga, right there. <laughs> yeah, it, like snacks. it looked like penne. It don't it, look it like kinda, it. It kind of does. <laughs> the, little, the little lines, you know what I'm saying? Hell yeah. Mm-hmm. You need to change the fucking contrast or something. <laughs> on Yo, come on. <laughs> I was like, is what? that food? <laughs> what, it needs to be a little darker or what? That's what something should... it looks like pasta to me, nigga. That's, that's she's, what shitting on, <laughs> she's shitting on our flavors, yo. Like, I'm not, I don't have on the, the mustard. I love the shirt. Nah. <laughs> I love the shirt, that's but I'm shit. talking about the picture. Nah, nah, it's all it like, looked like pasta. I thought it was you. eat <laughs> like something to it's eat. It's like, like a colorful pasta good. show. No, no, nah, it's, it's flavor. Okay, but it's not Psychedel- everybody. I'm sorry. Psychedelic pasta. I'm sorry to the world. <laughs> oh, no, you ain't got to say sorry. <laughs> not at you. And we got Bart's Barbecue up in here saying we should have a Be Real Faith Bart's Cali Blaze Aton Spaghetti Cook-Off. Let's oh go. Oh, why is, why is that so many I things? Wanna, I don't want to do no work. What is all of those things? I though? just want to enjoy the food. I don't yeah. want to be making any of it. What is all these things he said? Oh, those are be all people. Real. Be yeah. real. Faith, yeah. Bart, yeah. Cali. Yeah. That's yeah. us. Yeah. That, 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 he ain't cooking shit. Oh, no. <laughs> That's what I know. Oh, yeah. He's just bringing <laughs> the He ain't there. cooking no, shit. No, no. He ain't gonna be surprised. He don't look like he cooking that motherfucking <laughs> not, thing. Not too good, but I got busy. <laughs> you could, uh, you could he take look like he might take out a oh, fucking yeah. Ziploc yeah. for you to marinate your shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, Hand me the mustard. I got I got, I got, I got some some tricks on my sleeves. It's so good. <laughs> and <laughs> oh my God. Can you go get a bottle of red wine for me to soak these steaks in? <laughs> no problem. All right. I bet. <laughs> You're going to be real slow, though. <laughs> that shit going to take a long time. Yeah, yeah. Don't, don't, don't be in the Yo, I hate y'all. <laughs> 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 hey, we get it in. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what is, take your? Can you lift your? Can you do like you do when you go through TSA just for me? Ain't no, oh. Sure, let me see. No, uh, your glasses. Oh what? Oh no. Oh, there you go. Okay. Like, oh, there you go. <laughs> you don't it's want to see these, these? 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 <laughs> these <laughs> red? No. Red Jamaican Them eyes. eyes. Is different, you don't right? want to see these red Jamaican yeah, eyes. Yeah, you got island eyes. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> And we got Big J21 up in here asking Faith, what is your favorite gospel song to sing? To sing? Um, wow. It's typically a hymn. And you know what? It's funny because um, when I first got my deal, like I think I may have sang a gospel song after Puff met me in the studio. But he always used to ask me to sing it for the label people. And it was, um, um, it was uh, His Eyes on the Sparrow. And I've sang that, you know. Quite often, even not in church. That's like a go-to joint. Well, yeah, for me. Yeah. You know, it is one of them. Nice word. Why y'all got me looking high? Where's my makeup girl? <laughs> Can I get some eye drops? Oh, no. <laughs> See, you, you gotta took, wear you shades. Took, and we gotta get, we gotta get you the shades for the next one. You yeah. know what I'm saying? No See, you shades. took them flips. Yes. Okay, then yeah. no shades. I got plenty of them. I never put them on. Oh. Like. You was flipping and tossing and all that. Yeah, you know yeah. what? Y'all gonna stop the bullshit. You, you, Faith wasn't doing no fucking flip. Faith wasn't tossing right. nothing but the fucking Stroke. papers across Stroke. that checkbook. Stroke. There you go. You, you was, fuck you, 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 fuck you, is you talking about? You, 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 yeah, so fuck is the deal? You just, you just did five. Fuck five. is the deal. <laughs> Records.com, my nigga. <laughs> <laughs> fuck out of here with that bullshit. Fuck Records. <laughs> Trying to say. Oh, I want to know what he was trying. Okay, was, okay, play the beat again. Yeah, tamarine, go. tamarine. You ready? He was hey, telling you. Hey, he was trying to say. That was a good hey, yo, Dom, drop that beat. You need to do the tamarine while he say what he was trying you, to say. You was flipping this and you was tossing strudels. Okay, but play the See? tamarine. <laughs> I got there you what go up there. Trying to say. You were flipping Dom, this. drop that beat. And you was tossing strudels. Uh-huh. Hey. Hey, hey. Uh. Yo, what the fuck he was trying to say? Uh, I ain't tossing no shooters a day. <laughs> nigga know I'm from the brick city. And my motherfucking name is Big Biz Zay. Hey, yo, uh, uh. the fuck you want to do, nigga? Uh. Uh. And I didn't do, 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 nigga. 
You can't come through, nigga. Mm, you can't. Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, wow. Yeah. Yeah. We, we going to the studio right after that this. That was just some hot shit. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Yeah. Oh, yeah. We going to the studio right after this. If I write my raps, they'll be better. Be oh, yeah. busy. Be busy. Uh, we're going to have to walk right into the studio. Yeah, right after. Yeah, just. Yeah. Well, right. I'm, I'm going like, to Palm Springs, so. Yeah, I'm not going to the studio. It's a fuck that studio. I'm going to Palm Springs. I done paid for my house already. Bye. Bing bong. Bye. Bing bong. Bing bong. Oh, yeah. Bing, bing. What else you got, Bolton? Uh, we got Midget Mike up in here saying, Faith, how can we never released? How can I believe? 98. What's that? How can I believe? What? I don't know what that is. I yeah. see Midget Mike is making shit up. Yeah, Midget Mike's probably making something up. <laughs> yeah. no, it could be a mistitled song, you know? True. I don't know. How can I believe? Mm. True. You have faith. <laughs> Mm. Have faith. I'm not sure because I would love to. That was a question, question. I just asked. <laughs> I do not know the answer for this because I do not know that song. But we'll move on to the next one. Okay, thank you very much. We got uh, we got above and below <laughs> up in here asking Faith, can the Twitch Ward get a shout out from you? The who? The Twitch Ward. Twitch Ward. Right now? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever you want. That's Yo, tomorrow. what's up? What's up? What's up? It's your girl, the First Lady Faith Evans, and I'm shouting out the Twitch Ward in this month. Well, real. Blah. What up, y'all? <laughs> Hell yeah. That's right, God damn it. Thanks. And we got Big Rob up in here saying, wanted to say thank you so much and much love for Faith. As a father of a child on the spectrum, I appreciate you sending many blessings and love to y'all. Thank you and blessings to you and your family as well. And we got Al Loke up in here saying, we need an extra hour today for Faith. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They're going to they go, they go work me in their schedule. Oh, we're going to work they you gonna in their schedule. They're going to work me in their schedule. Oh, we're Schedule. working it in for sure. We got to make that happen. Absolutely. I am a blast. Hell, he's it. funny as hell. <laughs> <laughs> this one right here, the low key assassin. <laughs> Salt and pepper's here up there. Salt and pepper's here. That's right. He's <laughs> got too much. <laughs> he's in effect. What do you mean? Oh my God. You know what? <laughs> what do you mean, girl? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> Oh <laughs> yeah. And we got Zachariah up in here. Oh man. <laughs> Yo, Yo laugh stop go. laughing like that. <laughs> <laughs> that he's snickering like like what's the guy sniffly sniffles on the fucking lap Olympics? Yeah. <laughs> Metley Smitley Snow. <laughs> Oh, Smitley, Smetley ass, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh. What was his name? Yeah. <laughs> Smet, Smet. Yo, I'm going to throw my light over there. I could see. I, I could tell she she, she liked them, the <laughs> ha Hannah Barbarian um, cartoons the, back in the days. <laughs> no, you could tell I'm a life of the party when I go out. Granny be at home. <clears throat> I go to bed at 8 o'clock every night, though, actually. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Early party? 8, 8.30. Early party. I don't party. I be every day. I, be at Eight. Home. I told you I have three hours a day. To myself, eight thirty. But they, I am, you know, I wish my friends I. love me. Look, oh yeah, <laughs> my friends love me on the weekends. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be in bed at eight o'clock. Damn, I wish I could do that. I can't. Sometimes it's worth it. It is. Well, it is. It's been I, worth it for a long time. Hell yeah. I mean, I don't have no problem with getting my rest. Yeah, at I'm getting there. I'm. Get, I'm at trying. All. I'm, I'm like, there. I'm trying. I'm like, you That's know, how I tune out yeah. bullshit. I've been be better. Like, I'm going to sleep, motherfucker. Fuck that. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> True that. And you heal up. Yeah, that's how I fight pain. That's yes, you heal up. You know? I put the covers over my face. <laughs> <laughs> Works. It works. You know what? Fuck you. <laughs> but that's a fact. That's That sounds accurate. I don't snore like that, though. You could... Tone the tone down a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> At least. Put, put some auto tune. Auto -tune. Some auto -tune. No, take something off. <laughs> take something a little off. bit too much bass. It's too, too much, much everything. I don't do that. <laughs> that's, that's loud shit right there. I don't fucking have fucking. Waking yourself yeah. up and shit. Sleep apnea Ooh. and some shit like. Oh, <laughs> oh shit! You that know wakes what? up. That that rocks the house. Shout out to Biggie. Big used to snore like that. But he has sleep apnea. No word. Yeah. That shit sounds mm -hmm. crazy. That's the worst beat. I know I know some friends that yeah. used to snore mm -hmm. like that. Oh, sounds like they're dying. For real. Oh, try being on a bus with motherfuckers with that yeah. shit. Oh. Yeah. Oh. yeah. That shit is crazy. I have. 
Yeah, yeah I have to. <laughs> <laughs> it's a <laughs> crazy. You look well, I didn't know what that was until, yeah. you know, I heard yeah. that. I'm like, damn, y'all should be loud. Loud as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> All right, how, how many more we got, Bolton? We got a few in here. We got Zachariah up in here saying, toss that strudel. Oh, Can my God. You know what? We're going to make a song. Y'all toss it around. Make that one of y'all little... Song parody shit. <laughs> you know what I mean? Thank me later records. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you later productions. Toss that doodle, time to toss that. <laughs> mm. That shit'll be banging in the club. What you talking all right, about? All right, so we gotta do that shit. Next. Fuck me. Wait, I done talk do? all of my fucking lip gloss off, and y'all ain't even telling me because y'all ain't ladies, so y'all ain't even looking. Nobody <laughs> said put your lip gloss back on. <laughs> <laughs> my lip gloss is popping. <laughs> The fuck? Oh, we're going to do a moment of chaos real quick because they asked oh, for one. All right, so look. So, it hasn't been chaos already. Hell yeah. Oh, shit. But it's, it's going to turn it. it just, it's not over. Yeah, just, you know, it's you so could. Chaotic. You, you'll follow along right here. Okay. All right, all right three, two, one. <laughs> You do have fucking a moment of chaos. Yeah. 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 Stop talking about my talking red and fucking fuck fuck fucking fuck 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 chaos. Stupid fuck 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 and we got Eileen up in here saying, Faith is my girl, autism mamas unite. Hey. That's right. Shout out to everybody out there that's, you know, not even just children on the spectrum, but people with special needs. It's a, I mean, you know, of course I've, you know, I think everyone in their life knows someone that has had to, or if, what they're, whether they're in your family or not. Or, but, you know, yes. me having a child that has special needs is, you know, it's a, it's a different understanding and... The walk of it in itself is different, especially if you're really able to hone in and pay attention, you know? Not that people aren't paying attention, but you just don't, you want to think that, okay, they're doing right by my kid. They're doing, right. but it's not always that way so much. And me having a child that is not fully verbal, I'm not going to chance that shit. He can't tell me oh, what somebody did. Right. And what they you got to watch know. guard that. I done popped up and seen yeah. niggas mistreating him. And I was like, hell the fuck, nah, nigga. Word. Like, my nigga Whitney, rest in peace. Hell to the nah, nigga. Yeah. <laughs> like, nah, he out of here. I'm mm. not doing that. Yeah, you know what I'm happening. saying? It's, it's whack. Yeah. And they getting mad money, like, money for your child, even if it's in a public school. Yeah. A yeah. IEP is an They got a budget for that, yeah. Education plan. So you can't tell me my son should be doing everything. Every It's individualized. You getting money for him. Yeah. So mm -hmm. make that shit work for him. Don't make him fall into, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So, and on top of that, you mistreating them. If I'm not saying everybody is. Yeah. You know, shout out to all the great and great people, mm -hmm. whatever your uh, career is, but people in education, people that care for people with special needs. But, you know, sometimes people, that's not their passion. So, yeah, some people the abuse job, the shit. You know, yeah. they may have some even people. had education in a certain area, but, you know, I, I've seen it myself. You know, and, and I know that everybody isn't of the ability, tax bracket, whatever it might be, to be able to be on top of it or to just to be blessed to meet someone like I did to tell me, yo, don't do that. Don't sign that. Pay attention to this, you know? Yeah. But, but I know that if you are, if you don't know it, you ain't going to. You know, you want to think everything is good, like I said. And I've yeah. just experienced so much with my son being in the um, school system and... It's, it opened your eyes. Yeah, it did. Yeah. And it made me want to share the information with people. You got to. And we're going to a music festival. That's right. Stop. Hell yeah. Dr. Green Thumb is going to help me do Let's go. a music Shit. festival. Hell yeah. We'll make it happen. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's right. <clears throat> you heard it here first. Boom. What's the date? It's uh the 6th, May 6th. It's 1988. Hell <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. And we got J-Max T up in here saying it's Friday. Had some, let's see if I get this right, empanadas and patacones from the food truck plus Faith on a Friday. Ooh, we was thinking how awesome it would be to have Faith live with the Green Thumb Mafia. Oh. Who is that? Oh, my. Who that is? Uh, one of the, one of the fans. Green Thumb Mafia. Green Thumb Mafia. Is that a group? Yeah. Or something? Well, it's a thing we do once once a month where you know we'll get suited and booted and then play a set. 
Yeah. Oh, live? Live, yeah. yeah. Live. Oh, shit. Hell, hell yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah. Oh. That's no. real dope. See, that's what see, that's what I'm talking about. Dot com records entertainment. <laughs> dot organization. <laughs> see, we taking ahead. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Thank you. That's right. That'd be dope. See, they just telling y'all y'all should fuck with me more often. That's why they mm-hmm. yeah, Well, right. you don't. You know what I'm saying? We, we, we uh-huh. take it. They should let me pop up like toast. That's what I'm saying. You see? Fans. Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> You know what? <laughs> that strudel love. <laughs> Got that strudel love. Yeah, to- that's right. Strudel love. <laughs> <laughs> that's a new <laughs> song. Strudel <laughs> love. <laughs> Shoot me, doo wop. I want a strudel. <laughs> <laughs> that was too bad. Uh, no. <laughs> I want to toss you, baby. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Now you getting too fucking. <laughs> that nigga playing games. That's the fucking. That's some other shit right there. We talking about strudel. <laughs> we ain't talking about tossing. <laughs> we said toast. We said pop up. We said strudels and croissants. The word we avoided was tossing. I know the fuck I did. Yeah, exactly. I fucking avoided that word, so don't fucking talk. Oh, easy salt and pepper. Whoops. Right. <laughs> he want to toss somebody with his salt and pepper. That would so be find a salad, my motherfucker. <laughs> that would be very salty. <laughs> All right, you better find a salad. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. Oh, she's mean. <laughs> Hell yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah. I might cry now. Yeah. <laughs> 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 and next up in here, we got Nicole Cosmetis. <laughs> I love him. Yeah. Say it again. Hey, next up in here, we got. Yeah. Oh, that's, that's, right. <laughs> that's the best motherfucker. <laughs> oh, next up in here, we got Nicole Cosmetis. <laughs> yes, you do. Yes. She's saying, seeing Faith at the table just made my day. And Faith needs to be a regular on here. She's the best, and her vibe is everything. Yes. Yeah. Uh, yes. Agreed. We all right. agree with that shit. <laughs> Absolutely. Yo. We got mad phrases. Hashtag, he better find a salad. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody, we, chat, chat, snap, snap. We can create new ones by the minute. We better find a salad. <laughs> <laughs> toss it up, yeah. baby. Toss it up. Let me see you toss it toss up. Toss it up. I toss it up. <laughs> toss it up. Kai, shut up. <laughs> shut up. Right. My cousin back there laughing the whole time. Like, yo. <laughs> I know he's gonna kill me in the car, like, yo ass is stupid as that. <laughs> <laughs> yo, he laughing. Now. This is us every day, <laughs> like this shit. Me too, though. I'm saying. Yeah. And I'm not yeah. on the you podcast. You snapping no, in. This you don't have to like this, easy. This is us. Listen, you don't, you don't even understand. Let me show you something. <laughs> this is what I do. <laughs> Why is he still <laughs> laughing, though? <laughs> this is what I do with my niggas. <laughs> okay. Can you click on that right there? Yeah, I got you. All the way to the right. Turn it up. Go ahead, put it in your mic. Turn it up, though. Hit the volume on the side, probably. Yeah. No, not that one. Not that one. Not that Slide one. here. You got a faith shit. <laughs> you put it on yours. Yeah, you can use your, your mic right there. I see it, though. I want to Yeah, turn, turn, turn it towards the camera over here. Oh, okay. I got you here. Hold on. <laughs> Who is that? What? Who's singing? Who is that one to sing? Really singing? No, sure, sure. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Got me fun running around. <laughs> <laughs> Little C's. Yes! <laughs> oh, shit. That's crazy. This is what I do with my friends. I like, see what you're doing over I there. Put all the filters on them. <laughs> oh, yeah. She, she put it crazy. All night. She put he it was crazy. like, you can put a wig on me. Like, I'm going to keep you <laughs> yeah, she I'm put, driving. He's rolling. <laughs> she put a crazy ass filter on little C's right Yo, there. Was, this is yeah. what we do, man. We uh, laugh. Yeah. Alright. We laugh. We, we don't toss no salads. Yeah. <laughs> we be laughing. We be tossing yeah. No boing shit, nigga. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> what else you got, Bo? And, that uh, takes a special motherfucker right there. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> and we got Zachariah back up oh, in your seat. Don't try to be quiet now. Oh, we right here. <laughs> <laughs> we ain't got nowhere. Right here. Shut up, Kai. <laughs> <laughs> His name is Kai now. <laughs> no, my friend. My cousin is in the back laughing. Oh, I thought we were talking about Colton. No, I'm talking about my cousin that's laughing from all the way in the back. I hear him. He laughs at me all the time like, your ass is crazy. (laughs) Oh, yeah. And we got Zachariah up in here saying, Faith, you're awesome. Much love. Thank you, Zachariah. And we got J. Max D saying. Why you got to shoot me on that, though? (laughs) We dropped some bombs, baby. (laughs) All right. We got J. Max D saying, Faith, drop bars for us. Bing bong. All right. She Give did. me a beat. She, she did. did drop bars. I dropped some more. I'm going to let, Dom, I'm gonna let Dom do the beat. Tambourine Man. Let Be Real oh, man. lead me Hold in. Up, Let me switch it up. Damn. Here we go. Here we go, Tambourine Man. Follow Be Real. Oh. Uh. Yeah. yeah. Uh. There you go. You go. You go. You go. We go. Yeah. All right. All right, fuck it. I'm on your show. I'm going to try to do it right here. Go. I don't know I'm on your show. You go. You go. I'm on your show. Well, it's not even. Even Steven. This fucking weed that I'm breathing. It's uneven. It makes me feel like a demon. And I'm dreaming. We got Faith Evans on the scene. She's about to hit the mic. What you like? Do you want to take a hit? Or do you want to take the dab? What you want to have? Where we going? You could do the math. Faith Evans, stepping in. What you want to do, my mom? Bring it on. Uh, okay. Just bring it on. Okay. Okay. Woo. You know what? Them bongos is fucking driving me crazy. Nigga, take them out if you want me to rap, baby. My name is Big Fizzy from the Brick. Niggas always know I don't play that motherfucking shit. Step to me. Nigga, I'ma do you. Uh, 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 but I run right through you with my crew, my family from Jersey, the Rick, and they get no up. Hey, 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 hey. Woo! Yeah! I know what? Straight stop, fire, stop, stop. straight fire. Broca! Stop, stop. <laughs> You're gonna stop making me laugh over here. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna stop making me laugh. Oh, shit. That was awesome. <laughs> well, it was, you know. We tossing a croissant. We tossing a croissant. That's what I would call it. Tossing a croissant. That's right. You know what I mean? That's right. Don't hold me to it. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. but I will fuck somebody up if they try and step to me. And my family don't play that shit either. So I ain't lie. But I mean, that's not what I'm off. Oh, we, we <laughs> That's right. not why that that wasn't why I represented myself <laughs> <laughs> that way in the rock. Oh, yeah. That was all. We just high. <laughs> we high, yes. Word. That is the, that is fact. But I bet fact. you if you come outside when I walk out of here, nigga, you are uh, 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 <laughs> mm. Bing bong. Big bong. <laughs> Both. Hello. <laughs> I was just saying, we got a Todd Stop Watson. Stop laughing at me. <laughs> we got Todd Watson. What? Todd Watson back up in I'm your scene. I'm such a great spirit. You oh are. Hey. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm Jack. Oh, da, da, da. <laughs> <laughs> we got oh, Todd Watson in here saying, best show ever. Thank you, Faith. We got to start having Faith Fridays. <laughs> yes. That's right. Great episode in much Hey, love. see, come on. Shout out hey, to the hey. fans of the show, sure. baby. Right. Come on, fans of the show. Y'all got to put it it in the chat. Put it in the chat. Nigga, Christopher Williams said put it in the (laughs) chisnat. Put it in the chisnai, my nigga. That's right Right there. Fuck. Fuck is the deal. What happened? (laughs) Big fizzy from the motherfucking bricks all day. What? That's right. That's my name. (laughs) Fizzy Friday, (laughs) goddammit. Fizzy Friday. (laughs) Fizzy Friday. And I'm cool as fuck. Absolutely. Yeah. I mean, I'm not even aggressive. My talk no. sounds aggressive because I'm from Jersey, but oh, good. I'm so, so nice. I love everybody. No, it's not cool hoodie. No. That's super cool hoodie. Dope. For what we doing here. It's Versace, it's thank you. Oh my god. <laughs> oh yeah, that shit is snapping right there. Oh my god, yeah. it's Versace. No, I'm joking. <laughs> <Hell> yeah. <laughs> All right, what you Parachi. got? Shut up, Kai. Yo. <laughs> Why is he still laughing? Parachi. <laughs> it's Fanachi. <laughs> Fanachi. Fanachi. And we got J Max C up in here saying thank you guys for making this Friday everything. I think we went over time. Did they put you guys off air? We, <laughs> we, <laughs> we, we have went way past time. I talked so don't. fucking um, much. That's all right. <laughs> Too much tossing. How many yeah. more you got? Uh, you know what? Too much tossing. <laughs> <laughs> Too much tossing. 
And yeah. we just got a couple here. Uh, right. We got Mike Phillips saying, <laughs> <laughs> "I'm a <sauce. laughs> yeah. Stop yeah. it. Go ahead. All right. We got Mike Phillips up in here saying, uh, when you go to Cathedral City, you need to pick up some insane godfather. That's right. Pick up mm-hmm. some insane godfather when you go to that dispensary in Cathedral City. We'll, we'll hook you up. Thank we'll make you. sure they, they look out for you out there. If there are any police here listening, would they have stopped me on the way to that? No. <laughs> <laughs> because uh, <laughs> Nine. I will be driving. <laughs> <laughs> they leave you alone. I know it is legal, but you are not supposed to smoke in your car. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, God. Yo, I, yo, he's stupid, yo. All right. What else you got, man? And the uh, last, oh, shit. last one of the day, we got infinite blessings. It's not blessings. the last one. It can't be, no. <laughs> last no. super chat is infinite blessings saying, quick liquor shot for the people who care for special spectrum kids. Now yes. yes. Love and infinite blessings to everyone. Right. Come on. And Thank you. Shot. And you, you need saying, another one over there. Yeah. Thank you I for your one. energy, yeah, faith. Up. Hold on, let me get, let me get hey. less. Let me get the here. Pass this over. There. Can I give a shout uh, out? Shout out to yes. the Bronx, Malia the Cut, Mitchell that? and Associates, Delhi Autism Whisperer, um, Doctor Behave. She's up yeah. north. Shout out to Blues Brothers, the homegirl in D.C. She has twins that are on a spectrum. She has like a little. Um, sensory bus that she takes around and lets you know kids with special needs but you know we want to do stuff like that like i said i'm trying to help um malia Mitchell build a kind of boys and girls club for kids with special needs yeah and we just got a space so um if if people look on my instagram they can see the link if they want to donate it's a go for me for that yeah that's what's up cheers Mm -hmm. to that everybody can lift their cup yeah and take a Salud. And Dolly Peterson, Salud. all my parents that I know, um, Sherry and Sherry and all the parents, you know, because we have a little small mm-hmm. network that we try and keep our kids. We take them bowling and stuff. But, you know, it's definitely a difficult role, whether it's socially, whether it's um, personally, whether it's in school. You know, it's just a lot to navigate. Yeah. It is. And if you don't know, you don't know. Well, I'm glad you came here and let people know. And yeah. uh, they can. And they they said what happened. What they said they want. They want you back. Oh shit! They want you. Back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh. yeah. 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 Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Let me get it one more time. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Two times. Mm, yeah, yeah. See, th- this is the type of shit oh, I'm talking yeah. about. Hey, look, I want to thank Faith for coming through and becoming one of us just yeah, like yeah. fucking that. You know what I'm saying? Yo. Salute. What happened? Salute. Ow. God damn it. Hey, 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 hey. Yeah, um, yes, you definitely going to see her back with us. Thank you, guys. Fitz. Yeah, yeah. Hey, you, look, you can got- I go back to my nice voice? Thank you, guys. It's so <laughs> It's so nice being here. <laughs> you got any other shout outs you want to give before we go? I mean, shit, it's so many I could give, but shout out to, I mean, sh- everybody that fuck with me. But personally, there's so many people, you know, but shout out first and foremost to my kids and my family and the people that helped me with my son, Ryder, yeah. you know. Because that currently, like I said, is my current walk, you know. Shout out to all the parents with um, kids on the spectrum, with special needs, people that are raising, even whether they're a child or adult, with special needs. Um, You know, all the advocates out there. And, you know, like I said, I just want people to go back and look at my symposiums because they're informational. And look forward to our... That's right. Music festival that Be Real is going to help me put together. I was going to reach out to some other people, but the fact that you hit me actually put it on my heart to ask you to help me. I ain't going to lie. We will build. We will. We will build. You're going to help me, bro. I will. Mm-hmm. And we're going to smoke while we're doing We're going to do that. Yeah. 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 We're going right. right. to yeah. throw yeah. some croissants. Some croissants. <laughs> <laughs> Toss some croissants. Or C minus. You got a shout out? <laughs> Thank you to everybody that tuned in to the show and the, and, uh, the mixes this week. Uh, I'll be off all next week. 
and uh, I'll be back the next week after that. But thank you so much. Thanks, Faith, for coming and hanging out with us. <laughs> 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 yeah, it's been a, it's <laughs> one of the funnest shows we've had. <laughs> All of you. <laughs> and uh, thanks to everybody and uh, Psycho Beasy. Yo. Uh, shout out everybody watching on the check in, just booking out with us. <laughs> shout out to Faith for coming through. Hey. Oh, uh, man. Just, we we going to get into this mix. I don't know. Yeah, we, we, we going to get into we this mix kind of late. Yeah. Ten, ten minute mix, maybe after this. But, um, <laughs> Yeah. Shut up, Kai. <laughs> yeah, shout out everybody. And um, yeah, just <laughs> yo say, don't wake me, don't <laughs> squeeze me. Uh -uh. <laughs> <laughs> don't wake me. I ain't say squeeze. Uh, that's the remix. <laughs> that's the mustard remix. You know that's what? Never mind. Remix. Don't squeeze the mustard. <laughs> DJ mustard. Never mind. DJ mustard. Bolted. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, thank you, mustard. Uh, shout out to the insane right. asylum. Thank you guys so much. Shout out to Ray. You could have saved films. the squeeze. Don't wake me. I'm squeeze, and that would have been the, the, the oh. squeeze. <laughs> oh, yo, I I oh, see you yeah. there. All right. Yeah. Yeah. See, you I feel see. me? But he couldn't wait to squeeze. You feel me? <laughs> <laughs> that nigga in a rush to squeeze. <laughs> <laughs> he lives for the squeeze. Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> you could have been tactful about uh, that shit. Uh, you gonna work on it. I'm squeezing, <laughs> <laughs> but don't squeeze me. Like I don't want to. It's <laughs> <That's> too early. <laughs> oh, right, shit. you are saying it too soon. <laughs> <laughs> Let it wait. Oh, it looked too wild. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. okay. Okay, okay, back to the exit. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> Go ahead, Bolton. I was going to say, shout to the Insane Asylum, shout to Ray Morning Shop Film, shout to the Dominator, and um, also today, don't forget about those funkies, don't forget about the funky drop, and it's 15% uh, off all flower at Dr. Green Thumbs today yes. for Funky Friday. Oh, it is. Bo Bo. Flowers. All right, catch me on the socials on Twitter. Oh, yeah. Uh, no, at Eric Bobo on IG at Eric Jesus underscore Christ, Bobo and uh, <laughs> keep tossing Faith. Uh, um, <laughs> catch me catch me on, uh, on on Discord on Bobo's corner. Yo, I know you from Kane. Now that I thought about you, it, yes you I do. I remember you from yes, Kane. Yes bro. you do. <laughs> I know you now from Kane. Um, uh, thanks so to all right the, now, the like team icon peoples out there. <laughs> um, I hate you so much right now. <laughs> Shout out to my you girl, so Ashley right. Valentine, Jesus. and uh, me and Snacks. Thank you for your support. <laughs> Faith, thank you so much for coming through. Shut keep, up. Keep tossing. Shut keep the tossing, fuck baby. up. Keep tossing. Yo, shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to box as soon as you oh, come man. down them stairs. Yo, everybody, he's up on a pedestal. <laughs> that nigga up on a pedestal. Oh, I'm going to meet him as soon as he comes down them stairs. <laughs> shit. With a wop wop. <laughs> oh, Bobo. <laughs> whoop, whoop. Uh, and it won't be a toss. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Hello. Strudel. Oh shit. No strudels, baby. Right. <laughs> no strudels over here. Kelly Clay. Uh, quick shout out to my beautiful fiance, of course. Everybody who buys our products supports our brand. Fiance? What's that? Did you say you're great, fiance? My beautiful fiance. Oh, hey. Beautiful fiance and great. She's oh, beautiful so and awesome. great. So, oh, yeah. Both go. are great. Definitely. Can she take your jokes, obviously? Oh, for if sure. She, she, couldn't, fiance, she couldn't be with me if she couldn't take those jokes. Shit, I guess true. so. Yeah. Absolutely. Big shout out to Faith. Thanks if for coming she through. We all had a great voice, time. She must be a great one. She likes it, yeah. Ah. And yo, by the way, <laughs> fuck all you motherfuckers talking about my red fucking head, you cunts. Leave me alone. Yeah. It'll go away in a day. Tell <laughs> Anyway. That's because he ain't had my for shit, but I need, yeah, I need a little <laughs> remedy. That's right. But now, much love to all y'all guys, man, and everybody who follows the show. Thank you so much, and uh, we'll see you on Monday. Much love. Word. Uh, follow this on Apple and Spotify for the, the replay of this on the podcast form. Dr. Green Thumb Podcast. Make sure you visit the Dr. Green Thumb stores for the insane flavors and the Dr. Green Thumb flavors. You know you want them. Cause they fucking. I want to taste them now, even yes. though I like my own flavors. But we I'm will gonna taste them. We will get you Can some. Can I get that thing again, though? Oh, oh you want? Yeah. Not on camera. Okay, yeah, you know, yeah, after yeah, the yeah. camera go ahead, cuts. Go ahead, pass this God. over to her. You know what I'm saying? We right. ain't. We not tossing a bun or nothing, y'all. Yeah, though. No. That's right. Yeah. Tossing uh, the buns. I, I don't know if we. You know what? It. Don't <laughs> worry me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm squeezing. No. <laughs>
I'm dreaming. Don't squeeze. I don't want you to squeeze. No, you should squeeze. not be squeezing from up there. Word. That is very nasty. Don't, don't I that really is like very, to say you. Very nasty of you. You <laughs> cannot wait till you get in your personal room. Don't, don't squeeze in front of me. Yeah. Oh. Please don't squeeze. Don't squeeze, squeeze up there. Wait till you get back squeeze. to your right. hotel. Stay with love. Love is the key. No fucking booth energy. Yo, why I'm, am I grabbing it though? Yo, that. she nah. wants to flip. I don't flips. even know. I don't even know what to do. She wants that flip. I don't even know what to do. Flips in her life. I'm scared of that shit though. I'm not scared of much, but God and that. (laughs) Connie got your back. And a gun. Like, there you go. (laughs) Word up. Hey, we love y'all. We'll see y'all tomorrow or Uh, Monday. Sorry. One. Word up. God be willing. (laughs) 